So I got up early to go to the farmer's market and I know that I will probably take a nap. It's all quiet. It's pouring rain and the whoopy dogs are sleeping. So I was like, let's just catch up. There is a lot popping. Our girl is live now and there's been all kinds of stuff going on. So I figured let's go ahead and get into what is shaking. So I know that stories was live, but I figure like I said, there's a lot to cover, and I figure everybody can watch the recap. If not, it's all good, and then we can just get into it and be, man, there is a lot shaken. Kelly, welcome, MK. All right, y'all. Well, welcome, everybody. Let's go ahead and get started. Lane, welcome, and uh, let's do it. Dainty, welcome. Raccoon Man, great to see everybody. Bobbleheaded, yes. Tendies, Welcome. Let everybody get in and get situated. Happy Saturday, Dan. Y'all, it is pouring rain. Vanessa, welcome. So I figured that we'll do the quick notes of all the drama that's popping, and then I'll shut the window once we kick it on and see how it goes. Andy, welcome. Wendy, welcome. Kelly, Piggy, great to see everybody. Check Piggy out. Nashville Hot Chicken Sammy, welcome. Ronnie D, great to see everybody. Great to see everybody. Susie, welcome. Y'all. A lot brewing out here. It's not raining there, Kelly. It is, like, pouring. So I got the dogs. Went to the farmer's market with Grandma. Took the dogs, and it was pouring. I didn't even get them out of the car because I was like, it is just too wet. Patty, welcome. Left, welcome. Nesquik, welcome. All right, y'all. Well, let's get in, get situated, and we will do the notes. And then she is live, at least was. Duke, good morning, love. And then we will get into this live of, yo, is anybody, Chris, welcome, is anybody believing this newfound Chantal Tasha, welcome. Yeah, that's what I figured, I was like, you know what, I was like, one much popping Tasha, and I figured just, I was sitting there, and I was like, let's just cover everything, and just a quick little Robin, welcome. So I figured those are good, that when ain't a lot going on, and we don't have to have these long streams of, like, everything. I was like, okay. Oh, we're going to get all into it, Susie. Nice, Kelly. Oh, let's get into it. All right, y'all, let's do these notes. And, um... Tosh, welcome, or Tish, welcome. Okay. So let's start with yesterday, and then we'll trickle into today and kind of bebop around. So, Foodie, I don't know how you just manage. Well, I, I do know. How do you manage to just make every damn thing about you is beyond me? She does this thing about talking about, man, Dan, if they do, they are up out of here. That is like... That's on my list, too, y'all. That Knights of Chantal shit is the silliest. Muddled welcome. I would be embarrassed as hell. Chantal's emergency bees are fun. Welcome. Good morning, everybody. I would be embarrassed as shit as a 40, almost 40-year-old 40 woman to have, like, they think it's really something. First off, thank you, Bobbleheaded. LJ, welcome. Barbie, Welcome. They're like, we're going to go control everybody's comment section and everybody's lives. Well, let me tell you something, y'all. Nights of whatever the hell you got going on. That is a group that you've congregated and assembled, and that is against terms of service. You can't go, yeah, Knights of the Federales, you can't go control people's comment section. Right, Tasha? I was like, that shit is weird. Jarella, welcome. Lovely, welcome. Oh, we're going to get into it. It's it's great. It's it's Today is greeny welcome. So first off, let's start on a serious note. Chantal, why are you speaking for Gary, okay? You manage, she's like, well, what he did to me. Then you say, sorry, y'all, I got my notes. I'm looking down here. Then you say that you didn't even really listen to Gary's video. And welcome. How do you know what all Gary said if you didn't listen to his video? And once again, you managed to make that shit about yourself. K 
Karen, welcome. Sorry, I'm a little raspy, y'all. Chanto, leave Gary out of your mess. Leave Gary out of your mess. You, he don't need you to uh, make it about you. Maureen, welcome. Basically, what you did was, is you used Gary's trauma and his abuse to bring your drama with Natter. In my opinion, that's what you did. You used that way. You brought it up and then said, what about me? Not a gamer. Welcome. And then use that to spill bullshit. In my opinion, basically, that's what you did. So it wasn't about Gary, of course. It wasn't about Gary's trauma. It wasn't about Gary's abuse. It was about what you could make it and you could use that against Natter for your own benefit is what it was. Yo, that shit had me. I almost made a video last night and I was like, thank you, Dan, by the way. Thank you, love. I, it's just like, dude, she, she, I see right through this shit. I see right through it. How many do you guys see through this? For you guys and the replay. There's no newfound Chantal. Yeah, it was all about her. It was all about her bobbleheaded. Sorry, yo. I'm a little... Like I said, I've been out in the rain. I'm a little raspier than usual. And then to say... Thank you, Kara. And then to say... Well, I didn't even see really what all Gary said. Then how do you know what you're talking about? How do you know? That shit, I was like, man, leave Gary the f alone. Like, exactly. That's the thing now, Tasha. Exactly. That's the thing that exactly, exactly what I was just saying. Basically, you were bashing Gary... But now you feel bad for Gary. And then talking about people on disability get $250. Dude, why do you open your mouth about shit you know nothing? Yo, I'm fed up with Chantel today. I'm going to be real honest. I'm going to be real honest with you. I might be a little like, I, I, I'm sick of the game, sick of the bullshit. You brought that up, Chantel, exactly like Tasha said, to keep your storyline going. It was convenient for you to bring up Gary's drama and Gary's abuse for you to keep the shit rolling, is what, in my opinion, it was. Okay, y'all, let's go. So yesterday, you make this comment, Paris, welcome. You make this comment about, dude, Chantal's emergency visa friend, 100, sugar, welcome. Um... You make this comment as you're eating poutine and a corn dog. I know what you guys are thinking. I know what you guys are thinking. I'm going to go back to food. Dude, you never not went back to food. You've never left food. I'm so like, I don't know who, well, you got a handful of people over there. Your queen that you think that you're fooling, but we all see through this shit. We all see through it. We all see through it. You've never... Did you ate yesterday? I fell asleep to you eating, literally. Lady, welcome. Y'all, I was laying there in bed. Dazed, welcome. I was laying there, y'all. I think I fell asleep at like 10 o'clock, 10.30. Maybe 9 something. I don't even know what time I fell asleep. And she was still eating when I fell asleep. And I woke up and, of course, it said video... Um, detective, welcome. I woke up and of course it said video un unavailable. Right, I remember that too. Trisha Paytas' kid could afford therapy. Paris, thank you, love. So, you've never not left food. I don't know who you're fooling. Dude, you're literally eating a bite of poutine as you're saying this. Right, Dan? It's the same old shit over and over and over and over. Same today. This shit that you're talking about, oh my, you guys, get ready. You sounded wild, I'm just going to say the least. You're like, Didi, please leave him. Please leave him. Dude, we see through that shit. You want Dee Dee, Amy, welcome. You want Dee Dee to leave him so you can talk to him. 
We see through that shit. Please, DD, y'all, give this this clip that we're gonna watch is. It it was scary, literally. DD, please. He's ruining your life, DD. Please, spooky, welcome. Forever welcome. Please, please leave him, DD. Like, dude, you're you're a little out there. You're obsessed, in my opinion. Anybody that does not care about something does not address it 24 hours a day, seven days a week for months and months and months, dude. Little bot, welcome. Sorry, y'all. I'm not agitated with y'all. I'm so sick of the same bullshit. And then she's like, I'm a dude. Nobody's scared of you. Nobody's scared of Natter. She talks about if Monty goes to court, she's going to watch it. And she literally says, be careful, Monty. Take something with you. Are you f***ing crazy? Smelly cat, welcome. You cannot take weapons or pepper spray in the courthouse, dude. Figure out the law. Nobody cares about you. Nobody cares about Natter. Nobody over here. Nobody in where I'm at. Natter can come up in this bitch today. And ain't nobody scared, dude. Nobody's scared of you. Nobody's scared of Natter, but maybe you and Dee Dee. I'm not scared of Natter. I don't think any of y'all are probably scared. Natter ain't shit. Straight up. Natter is not, nobody's scared, yo. Nobody is scared of Natter, dude, but you and maybe Dee Dee and Beats. That's it, yo. Man, not a gamer. Thank you. See, ain't nobody scared. Natter is the type. Dude, I came across Peach. Welcome. I've came across people like this. Natter only goes at people he knows that he can bully and scare to him. Ain't nobody scared of Natter, yo. Nobody. Tizzy, welcome. Ain't nobody scared, dude. Cut that shit out. And you talking about it. Ain't nobody coming to your house. Maybe the people that you threatened, allegedly. But ain't nobody, ain't nobody worried about you, dude. Ain't nobody, nobody gives a shit. I don't know what you think. Like, dude, you're not Pamela Anderson. You're, you're not. Exactly. Thank you, Tendies. Easy targets. Exactly forever. Ain't nobody scared, yo. And then talk about a gun. Dude, you don't even have a gun. This is probably going to be demonetized, but I don't even really give a shit right now. You ain't even got a gun. What do you keep talking about guns for, dude? You ain't even got a gun. Even if the Can Canada wasn't like that, I wouldn't even trust you with a gun. You don't even know how to operate a gun. You're the last person, in my opinion, that needs a gun. God, dog, yo. Y'all, I'm so over her crap. Talk about, if, if anybody comes in here, I'm going to defend myself. Yo, you couldn't even carry up some toast up the steps the other day. Knock it off, dude. See, this shit that you're talking about, all this wannabe, this, that, and the other shit. When you do see somebody in real life, man, come on now. Does anybody believe that if Chantal came across Michelle, welcome. Is Nessa, welcome. Is anybody believe that if Chantal got confronted by anybody in real life, does anybody over here really think that Chantal's going to do anything? 100 bobbleheaded. She does not need to have any type of star welcome. Like I said, even if Canada, I know they're very hardcore with their gun laws and stuff, but man, ain't nobody. <sighs> she wouldn't even laugh. She would, she would whistle away eating a bite of sandwich. Okay, so let's move on. So you literally, speaking of craziness, you literally said today, and then you changed it, 
and caught yourself. You said, Modi, welcome. Yo, she said she would dismember him. And then listened how it sounded and said, well, like a bug. Like a bug, you guys. Dis dismember him like a bug. After she realized how crazy it sounded. I probably would have... I was like, dude, you're in out there, yo. Yeah. Yeah, and yeah, watch Barbie. See, I'll get a yellow or a red money sign. And she's literally over here talking about dismembered. See, that's what she was like, Sagittarius Shorty. Okay, not to be mean. VC, welcome. Not to be mean. I know some of y'all like Sagittarius Shorty. But that's another one that, dude, there's a clip going around. Sagittarius Shorty is not about that life either. I'm sorry. Sagittarius Shorty got into a fight and it's on the tubes. And let's just say that's another one that... And, and I'm not trying to be mean. I'm just going by what I've seen on the video. Sagittarius got her tail handed to her very quickly. So, okay. Let's talk about Jessica. Ma yeah, it did not end well. Yeah, it did not end well. Yeah, it did not end well. I do got to get a better chair. Um... Susie, I don't think it was. It was a video. Actually, I think I've seen her get drug on the internet twice, if I'm not um, for sure. Right, Jarella? And, like, ain't nobody scared a natter, yo. Like, he's got this, like, ain't nobody scared a natter. Let's just, I'm probably, this is probably a wrap, but oh well. I need to vent and get this all out. So, Jessica Mesca. Amen to her, burnt the Michael Kors sweatshirt. I told y'all, I told y'all, I told y'all. That girl was just trolling Natter. I'm glad that she stuck up for Gary. I knew that. I knew damn well she was not going to wear that sweatshirt around. Yo, Jessica Mesca was trolling him, in my opinion, from the get-go. Did I, did or I not say that? Did I, did or not say that? Homegirl was trolling him from the get-go. So, yeah. So, after this video, she needs to worry about unblocking people. Dude, why even bother at this point? Why even bother? Nice bobbleheaded. Um, why even bother? I don't know, Tendies. I don't know. I think he, yeah, I think he might have because she showed the envelope on a shorts clip. So I don't even know why you, um, do this, you know. You said yesterday, literally yourself. Well, the gym thing might, the gym thing is going to happen. It might happen. Do I believe she got a gym membership? No. Do I think that Chantal is ever going to change? And I'm again not saying this to be mean. Chantal is too wrapped up. She is beyond her food situation. Y'all, sorry, I don't want to say situation, but YouTube, you know how it is about things. It's, it's too far beyond her control. She's not going to quit the Chibas. She's not going to quit the gummies, which that makes her eat even more. Dude, She, I literally fell asleep to her eating and eating and eating yesterday. She's, she's too far. Yeah, all the regular people are going detective. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a new group of tell patterns and just constant... Shell, welcome. And that's the other thing, Shell, that people, you know, that us have been invested like our little soap opera here. Sean Toll's relationship with BB, yo, we watched this transpire. 
Sean Toe has, in my opinion, things have been messed up for years that, I mean, at least that we've seen on camera. I've never, I've mentioned you guys, my aunt, God rest her soul, that was heavy set that passed away. My aunt that took me to the bingo and we walked everywhere. Pookie, welcome. My aunt was a heavy set woman and my aunt did not eat like that. Kamikaze, welcome. Pop was her thing. My aunt worked in a nursing home. Jamie, welcome. We went to carnivals, fairs, bingo, swimming, you name it. And I don't know, maybe just my, I, I mean, I was young, like I said, and we did eat a lot, you know, out on the weekends, but my aunt walked everywhere. We would catch a taxi. We would go to the zoos, the fairs. Anyways, you know, I know that pop was her thing, but our girl, welcome. Um, SCL, welcome. I, I've never seen anybody eat like Chantal consecutively for hours, hours, hours upon hours. I've never seen anything like it. I, I have it, honestly. I've never... Trailer Park, welcome, love. I've never seen somebody eating their meal. Literally. And then, I am Dee Dee, welcome. Exactly, I am Dee Dee. RG, welcome. Um, I've never seen somebody, you know, eating and then being like, what are we going to have for dinner? So, her merch, now we all know that um, her merch is going to be, these are her exact words, her merch is going to be, thank you, Dee Dee. Thank you, Dee Dee. Nice. Awesome. Nice, Kimikaze. Well, awesome. I will check it out. Thank you for stopping in, little Aussie. Welcome. Thank you, Dee Dee. Andrea, welcome. You just read my mind. Chanto, Lisa, welcome. Chanto, do you think that anybody, first off, I don't believe you're going to create it. And what kind of half asparagus merch is that taylor welcome love ain't nobody gonna wear a shirt that says thank well maybe the 10 koc you got it or kof sean tall the federales over there the comment police who dude anybody can go get a shirt pressed and say thank you dd Dee Dee. Anybody catch a reactor? No, I have not. Um, dude, anybody can go get a shirt that says, thank you. Why are they going to pay you 35, 30 bucks? And I'm just averaging most people's merch. Dude, you can take a t-shirt. At, don't nobody want a shirt that says, but no, make that. Go ahead and make that. Please make that. Right? The KFC gang. That's more like it. Man. Okay. So, then she says she doesn't think today. So, people say, you know, when are you going to apologize for, you know, when are, when are you going to apologize for all these stories and different things you've changed up and he hit, did it, he didn't hit. I don't think women should have to apologize. I don't think women should have to apologize. So, you don't think that there's men out here that, that this shit don't happen to? And you don't think that women that go, Great Grebo, welcome. You don't think that... You, you, you don't think that making false police reports, wasting the Canadians' time? Right, raccoon? Gosh, Patrice is taking a nap, thank God. Um, You need to just think, you know what, I'm not going to tell her nothing to do. Because I'm watching this ship tank, I, I'm not giving her no, let me, let me reframe it in. You know what, Robert, welcome. 
I, I think anybody should apologize to their audience if, you know, but you'll never understand it. So I'm not even going to say nothing. Hold on, where's the mouse? Here we go. Okay. So she says that, um, Shireen, welcome, love. She would rather travel the world than be bogged down with the narcissist. I do think you are a narcissist. Again, that's my opinion. I truly do think you're a narcissist. Last night, Lee, welcome. They were like, you're not a narcissist, Chantal. You're not. You're not a narcissist. You have to fit all the characteristics of a narcissist. Well, you're more than welcome there, federales of the current police, to go. Pretty sure we covered this a long time. Shanto is a narcissist. Shanto uses people. Shanto has wrecked. They're like, you've never wrecked nobody's life. You don't think that... Okay, let me ask you all this on a serious note. And I know pizza's grown. But you don't think... That Chantal has helped, in my opinion, with uh, Pete's mental health deteriorating. I think so. Now again, he's a grown adult. But do I think being around her, being a gopher, yes, the other day, dude, uh, literally, yes, Pete's. Is it right, Pete's? Okay, Pete's. Right, Pete's? I think, you know, like I said, he's a grown adult, but exactly dainty, and I do believe so. Peach Girl 100. Oh, Robert 100, and I'm sorry that... Sean told, see, you know, we'll, we'll talk about things, ghost, welcome, love. We'll talk about, like, Gary did, you know, kind of give you, like, you know, I did, like, a backstory about, you know, um, oh, we're gonna get into that. We're gonna get all into the, the whole Dee Dee and Natter situation. Um, you know, it, it, it's kind of to get to know somebody and really kind of, you know, know what they've been through and kind of Irene welcome you know Gary kind of opened up you know his book to us about his life I as well have done the same thing and it's very ironic and very eerie how much me and Gary have in common um damn Kate welcome thank you Delilah welcome um Barbara welcome everybody coming in it, it's very eerie. Um, me and Gary have a lot of similarities in our life. We really do. Um, recovery, childhood trauma. We we have a lot. I, I and maybe that's I don't know why I kind of we hit it off. You know, in the beginning, you know, just kind of. But we we have a lot of similarities of our life. A lot. But um, you know. I know that we talk about it. I, I guess, how do I word this? Um, we talk about things we've went over in here, but Chantal just kind of just throws it every fucking day, dude. Me, me, what happened to me? Pam, I'm doing good, actually. I went to uh, the uh, farmer's market with my grandma, and it poured down rain, but I got some cool stuff. And uh, maybe after this live, I got a couple things to haul. Maybe I'll show you, like, a farmer's market haul. Um, Chantal, I do believe, um, you know, has always, oh, this is going to sound crazy and mean, but I'm going to say it, blonde, welcome. I, guys, I really think that I'm a, I really think that I'm, I think I'm addicted to cocaine. Chantal is, and, and I know that sounds terrible. I, I really don't want to sound like that. But Chantal really, in my opinion, likes the victim card. Um, I mean, there's a difference between sitting here and shooting the shit and constantly, you know, but it's a difference when you're telling and opening up. Like, it, it's hard for me. I don't want to sound like a hypocrite here. 
you know, because I do open up to you guys. So I don't want to sound hypocritical here, but, um, you know, it, it's just like, oh, guys, what happened to me? And what happened to me? And just, just, oh, like, you fuck drove yourself back there, dude. And I don't want to say that somebody else's trauma is, you know, I don't want to compare traumas here. But me and Gary, as little ass kids, didn't have our option to drive our ass over there. We didn't. Ha we didn't have the option of, you know, I'm I'm, I'm going to chill out because I don't want to, you know, dredge up Gary's past or mine. But we were fucking kids. We weren't driving our asses over there. Exactly, great Grebo. Shelby, welcome. Or sh is it Shelby Love? Welcome. We, me, me and Gary were fucking kids, dude. And like I said, I'm not, I don't want to be that person that, you know, anybody's trauma is, is worse because that, that's not what I want to do. Thank you, Shelby. Exactly. No control. So let's move on from that. I, I don't want to, you know, but you, 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 you talking about traveling in the world and doing it, Sh uh, Chantal, is two different things. I can, Pippi, welcome. I can, I can sit here and say, oh, tomorrow, you guys, I'm going to take you to Paris. Tomorrow, you guys, I'm going to take you to Paris. Tomorrow, guys, I'm going to take you. Tomorrow, tomorrow. Ain't no f tomorrow. Am I going to Paris tomorrow? No. And she says today, guys, no trailer park. And that's another thing, dude. She ate muffins yesterday, poutine. Like, dude, she she showed them cows from her car and couldn't even get out the car to show them the cows. Make it make sense, dude. You could have pulled over off the side of the road safely and... You exactly, raccoon. Tomorrow never comes. I can I can set here, S Cindy. Welcome. I can set here and until I'm blue in the face and tell you, guys, I'm gonna take you guys to Paris tomorrow. I'm gonna take you guys to Paris tomorrow. I ain't got no damn money to go to Paris, and we ain't going to Paris tomorrow. It would be a beautiful thought in theory. It's just, I, I'm lost on this whole new group of people, that situation. Welcome. Oh, yeah, and I was so busy yesterday, you guys. Truth, welcome. Busy doing what, Chantal? Busy doing what? You made a video about garlic bread, and you deleted it. Aunt, welcome, love. Why do why keep deleting this shit? Why? If you mean it, say it. And everybody's already got it archived. Stout garlic bread and dude, you you're such a keyboard warrior. You're you're such a keyboard warrior. You really think that you can just do whatever you want. Garlic bread has never said anything mean about you. He stated facts and he stated shit. Stout garlic bread and stupid. <laughs> you take shit over the edge. And you know you do. And that's why you delete it. Sorry, all my lips are getting dry. You talk about garlic bread has given you the benefit of doubt. People have gotten his ass the other day and I even seen it in his comment section. And we all said, garlic bread, look, 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 we, we've been down this road before and I'm guilty of it too. That's why I didn't really say much because I'm guilty of it too. We've been down this road with Chantal. We've all gave her the benefit of the doubt. Have we not? Puppy breath, welcome. Has most of us in the beginning of watching Chantal and even me, I'm guilty of it, tried to give Chantal the beginning of the tried wish welcome 
We've all been there. And we've got burnt thousands of times. Chantal is not going to change. And I'm, we're going to hear about this counseling till the 28th for days and days and days, dude. Chantal, one, if you do go, and I don't think, I think she's going to make something up because she says she has to pay out of pocket. Right, Aunt? Burn to a bloody crisp. Situation. Thank you, love. We're going to hear about this counseling for the next damn two months. So, counseling's allegedly July 28th. Do I think that she's going to pay for counseling with her own money? Absolutely not. Yes, Trailer Park. We've got counseling on the 28th. And this new... I, I really think I'm going to grow my hair back luscious. I really think it's going to grow back thick. I'm not being a dick again. I I don't... If you see the way it's growing... Diamond, welcome, love. I, I, I think the hair is gone. I know we've all got into this dispute. I think there's a category of things. I think there's the hormones, the poor eating. What are they, love? OM, o, o -M oils? I'm confused. What OM oils? What do you guys... Um, Ome, Ome lip oils. You guys, my CVS around here is slim pickings when it comes to some stuff. I'll check and see if I can find it. But my CVS, like, they really don't have much in the beauty selection. But I will keep my eyes peeled. Let me write that down. Yeah, I'll keep my eyes peeled because I do love... Jacqueline Hill is coming out with different colors, but I wish they would change that component. Okay. Sorry, y'all. Okay, so here we go. Let's get into Dee Dee and Natter. Show of hands, you guys, and please on the replay, because I've got to know... Are, are, are you guys in the same boat as I am? But these two been together for the last seven months. We've been known. Oh, she says she likes that phrase today. Remember, she was making fun of all of us for saying it. Now she likes the saying we've been known. Of course you do. Who thinks show of hands? These jokers been together for seven months. I'm not for sure, Robert. I honestly don't know. Uh, the Jaclyn Hill ones, I thought, were vegan and cruelty-free. A majority of the products, don't quote me, I, I don't have 100% clean beauty, but Desiree, welcome. Majority of the companies I try to mess with are, um, yeah, Chantal. They've been together for the last seven months, dude. You're late to the party. See ya, Beverly. Welcome. Dude, I they, they've been together. It was a cash grab plot for you. Say by Jesus. Welcome. It, it was a cash grab plot. Karomi, welcome. To say they weren't together to get money from you. They were hustling you. How many people, dude, we've told you this for seven months straight. Janet, welcome, love. So, Natter drops the ball, kisses Dee Dee, says, oh, she cares for me, so therefore I'm going to be with her. Dude, we've been known you were together. We already knew. The only one that didn't know, obviously, was Chantal. Tendies, welcome. Serendipity, welcome. Thumbs up, y'all. Make sure you're subscribed. They've been together. We already knew that. So, okay. I think that, um, I keep seeing a Sam's Bar Lounge. Hold on, I want to write that. I, I keep Sam's. I keep seeing that around. Oh, speaking of what I keep seeing around, too. Let's, let's. 
Let's discuss that right quick. Okay, listen to me. Sarah Jane's journey. Sarah Jane has been reacting to Sean Tall. And she has been pretty heated. And now I understand why she's heated. Nice trailer park. What did you get? You, Sean Tall. Do not. What you put out here. Nice trailer park. What you put out here, Chantal, is what you put out here, okay? Um, I do have the pay a, a mod. Do I have any mod? Yeah, great Grebo. Uh, my PayPal is my um is my um great Grebo. Will you drop my email? And my email is always I put it in the description of the regular videos. I think Great Grebo is still in here. Okay, listen. Chantal, you are foul for talking about Sarah Jane's mother that is going through cancer right now. There you go. Yes, that is the PayPal, and you will see my emoji on there. Leave Sarah Jane's family out of that shit. I wondered, Sarah Jane had been very, very fair to you. And I watched her last couple videos, y'all. Check her out. I think it's Skinny Queen Reacts. You talking about Sarah Jane has been a crappy friend to you. Sarah Jane stuck with you. I've watched all through the get-go. Yes, the P.O. Box is always on the regular videos. Always the regular ones. Um, leave people's family out of it, Chantal. That was not right. See, you play dirty. Scottish, welcome. Scottish Girl Reacts, great to see you. Okay, let's check that out. Let me write that down as well. I do got like a little rotating one that's pretty good, actually. It's quiet. Um, but I still try... And it's on QVC. Okay. Thank you, Scottish Girl Reacts. Um, anyways, long story short, Chantal, when people are going through shit with their family, that has nothing to do with YouTube. Leave that mess out of it. Ruby, thank you, love. Um, wow. Tish says, he dogs Jennifer and her kid in a life. See, he's going to end up knocking himself off. These two here are both going to end up knocking maybe sooner than later, maybe later than sooner. But, um, thanks everybody that's popping in, popping out. I know it's kind of a weird, um... I'm not sure, uh, Sarah Jane didn't say Trailer Park, but I just seen Sarah Jane's community post, and it said, you know, Chantal, leave my family out of it. And I think the Yaba said something very smart the other day. If Chantal gets knocked off, I'm not going to go chasing her around unless shit is, um, nice bobbleheaded Kristen. Welcome. Unless shit is interesting. If she would get knocked off of YouTube, I'm not going chasing her around. This shit is getting like, if, if she gets knocked off and shit's interesting, we'll stay on it. But dude, this shit is like, I want to write in my ear. When she's eating. I, I, I can't even do the eating anymore. I mean, not that I ever could, but... Thank you, Ashley, and welcome. Okay. So she's in the brawl again today. Ruby, 100, me too. Everybody's like, Chantal is this new... Dude, they're all three garbage. 
They're all three garbage, in my opinion. I'm not all, like, Sierra, welcome, love. Um, I'll break just saying or somebody off or we'll keep an eye on it, but I'm not chasing her from here to there to we'll figure it out or I'll break just saying off or something, some dough, but or something, somebody, but So, I don't believe anything about, now, you know, I know that Natter's a weasel. She's talking about Natter wanting to sign her to sign a contract. I don't believe that. If you remember, she was talking about she watched a couple that had a contract. Uh, no, Trailer Park. He asked her for money. Perfect timing. Right before the date. Ask her for money. Who would have thought? It's, it's, it's interesting. These guys are dirty or they ask her for money right when the dates are about to happen or about like a function's about to happen or people start to ask about them. But anyways, I don't believe there were, he asked her for a contract. She mentioned a couple that she had seen on YouTube or one of the platforms that had a contract. Uh, again, she's got this bra one. Um, the KO, KOC, KFC shit is weird. <clears throat> uh, she says, guys, I'm so glad I left him. Sherry, welcome, love. Chantal, you were just literally getting, asking him to come to your hotel. You, you're trying to make up this whole thing again, and these are only my opinions in my chats. I think that BB was like, yo, we're done. Again, you broke up with BB. You broke up with Natter. Um, so let's get into it. Let's get into today. Um, Tessie, welcome, love. I did not, Little Aussie. Maybe we should check it out. You know, and that's the thing, Little Aussie. Uh, we talked about this this past week. Chantal just can't let it go. When somebody leaves her camp, you know, they can't just let it go. Or, excuse me, she can't just let it go. Again, like I said, we don't know what somebody's going through in their real life. Adele, welcome. Excuse me. We don't know what somebody's going through in their real life. But, Chantal, when you keep talking shit about all these people, they're not going to come back. Maybe they were having a bad day, and then you run your mouth, and then they're never going to come back. So, you only ruin yourself. And, and, and I love that for you, to be honest. Because I'm, quite frankly, sick of your shit. Dude, the lies. The lies. Like... I really think that she believes all this shit. I really think that she is like believing her own lies at this point, yo. All right, let's get into it. I I really think that she is like S G. Welcome, love. Okay, so this is the beginning of today, and we're gonna beep up around this. This is called Ha Ha. Y'all, excuse me, ha, ha, all fake, here's why. Well, you know what? You're fake, too. Everybody, you're fake, Natter's fake, Dee Dee's fake, Beats is fake. Y'all are fake. They're all fake, you guys. Every one of them. Oop. She said, Sandra, this one's for you since you're still paying. And put an app. Wow. I hope Sandra, see... You just probably reminded Sandra that she was still paying you. Critically welcome. Good job, Chantal. You probably just... I, uh, we need to tell Sandra that, Joe. So, our little... Uh, our, our little sunshine here is... Yes, they're all fake. I agree, Ruby. And again, these are only my chats. Opinions and mine. These are not facts. Um, our little princess here has got her sports bra one for, I don't know, y'all, what, two, three days now? 
So let's listen to our pleasant peach uh, that she's done talking about him. It's weird. She grabbed a tissue, Tish. So, I tell you, Maggie. They oh, do we? look puffy like she's been crying. Look at that, y'all. Yeah, Tish, good call. It's interesting. She comes in with the tissue, too, at the beginning of this. Wookie, welcome. Okay, y'all, let me know. I'm going to hit it, and let me know uh, right quick if the birds are too much. Let me know, guys. And then the fucking, it looks fake. And then the fucking necklace with Debbie. Dude, do you not remember us making fun of Debbie fucking what's her face? You're like, Debbie, Debbie. Now, your new wife is a Debbie. <laughs> and, am I in shock? I'm in shock that he had to do this next move to keep himself relevant. Yeah. I'm like, we all... Dude, it wasn't... Okay, let's let's discuss this. Is the birds too much, guys? Okay. He didn't do this move to keep himself relevant. He did this move to deflect off the shit that he did to Gary. It wasn't for you. It, it, it was not for you. He did that shit because he knew he up with his numbers he didn't do this shit for you he did it to deflect the Gary situation that's what he did because all of us in here everybody showed of hands literally we knew they were together you're the only one that's late to the party it was to deflect the Gary situation that's all it was Yeah, see, say by Jesus. Say by Jesus says Natter lost 170 subs. Bex, welcome, love. Okay, well, let me know. I, I, I don't honestly, if the birds get to be too much, let me know. It's just nice and cool because it's raining out. So I uh, don't, it won't offend me if the birds get to be too much. Uh, Sierra Natter, basically, I'm not even going to say it on my channel because it's disgusting. And, uh, Trudy, welcome, love. Um, there's plenty of videos of it. Check out the clip channels. Natter, basically, I I'm not even going to because I know that Gary sometimes watches my replays and I'm not even going to say the disgusting things. Basically, he... Basically made it like uh, Gary as a child kind of could have, you know, I, I, why did you let that happen to you? Respect, like, I can say it as, as look at the clip channels. Um, basically saying that, you know, Gary was a little child, that he wasn't a real man. Like I said, I don't even want to. It's terrible, terrible things. But check out the clip channels, got it, so you don't even have to go there if you catch my drift. Exactly. Exactly, Grebo. Yeah, read, read Great Grebo's comment, y'all. He, he, it, it was beyond disgusting. Doesn't even, I don't even know, horrendous, horrifying. Um, I don't even want to say the things that, let me stop before I end up getting knocked off. I like the term now. We've all been new. Dude, we've been saying that. Shut That's it. The, point. the fuck? I need to go back to bed. Yeah, you need to no, go to bed. Audio. Ew, uh, what was it? Her, con her confirming? The three of course I didn't lie about that. Why would I lie about going down on her? And that's your life now. <laughs> it was cold. Everything about her is cold and clammy. I'm not shaming her. I'm just objectively. She was cold and clammy and I hate it and I was miserable. And you made me freak out. That whole experience. I freaked out in Cuba. So out of the loop. <laughs> the Colleen. <clears throat> I need my puffer. The leaked audio happened right when they announced it. There you go. So now that they're... So they, they admit their lies when they're forced to. Basically. Should she explain the whole three sons? Ugh. There you go. Was I lying about that? 
Oh, Jennifer Corvino, thank you very much. <laughs> the audio is Didi confessing him sleep sleep. Oh, 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 so now they confess to sleeping together. So, so, I have written confirmation that you said you don't sleep with her. I don't, bitch. I have those messages. So that's proof that you're a fucking scammer. Because you were scamming me the whole time, promising me. Really, after, oh my god, only someone evil could watch somebody go through what I went through with him? Like, willing to take your abuse and everything? To be lied to over and over? That is fucked up. How many? Why don't you just start numbering these? Right situation, that's exactly what I was going to get to. How about you just start titling these Natter Fest 357, Natter Fest 358. How many, dude, take the L and move on? Can you imagine waking up every fucking day? Excuse my language. I know some of y'all don't like when I cuss, and I apologize. Every day, dude, we know what you said happened. Kim, welcome. Every day, dude, it's the same shit or it's different shit. Or Gotti, or Gotti, welcome. One day it's this, but it's the same old shit every day, all bobbled up. Oh, oh, jumbled up, this lighted. Then today, I thought, okay, I thought he didn't hit you. I thought he didn't hit you. The other day you said, he never hit me. Peach Girl, 100. The other day, you said, well, guys, I'm going to be honest. He didn't hit me. Well, now today, it, what is it? What is it? I've been with somebody for straight eight years, somebody for like six years, and gee, many Christmas. It, it, it's, it's the same, I mean, little switched up pieces, but Amber Nicole, welcome. Nice, Amber Nicole. That was my plan to take us outside today, but the weather said no, ma'am. Dude, literally woke up. I did, t I think so too, Truth. I think that, you know, I just say the same shit over and over. Like, I think that, Chantal, you played a role in this. You did too. All three of you, it's the same shit every day. Please give me a panel now. What? Tracy, what happened? A panel for what, dude? Are they fucking for real? They're so disgusting. And you know what? All you're doing, you're not making me mad. You're not making me jealous. You're just... I can't tell. Everything I knew about you was right. All of the lies everyone's ever warned me about you. So, seven, eight, nine months later, it's, it's, it's just now coming together. Dude, take the f L and move on. Take the L, dude, and move on. Shoddy mama, welcome, love. Take the L, Chantal. You, you cannot let this go. I firmly believe... Oh, produce. After this, we'll probably do a farmer's market haul. Um, haul some of this shit. Just chill and just... Can you just... You, you can't let this go. You cannot let this go, can you? I firmly believe you cannot let this go. I'm telling you, puppy breath. Um, uh, hopefully we'll be awake to get... Or, you know, I gotta be careful in here, but you know what I mean. Chantal, let it go, dude. Exactly. Thank you, Trudy. 14 days ago, you just had a cheapest care package in a damn-ass hotel that you were going to Uber him up there. And then you slip up today, I caught you, and you said, he still answers my phone calls. He still answers my phone calls is what she said today. But we're going to watch a little bit of this, and we're going to get to the middle where she just... It, Oh my gosh, y'all. 
it's it's literally like, dude, if you've seen one, you've seen them all. But yeah, she says, and where's the beat? Where's the uh, Tweakins? Welcome. Is there a bird in here? Welcome. Where where's your chat to pick up on this? You said today, literally, he still answers my phone calls. Right. All right. Tracy, I know. Can you imagine? All your lies were true. Uh, Dude, we've been telling that you this. That you, I was vindicated after all. Now, why don't I feel better? Because vindicated for me means facing so much truth that I already, that you people were telling me was true all along. You know? Really? Who would have thought? You're a disgusting fucking liar. I wish I never gave him anything else. After that, I wish I knew that sooner. <laughs> she wishes sooner, yo. Debbie is fully masked off. Oh! Wait, you think that I'm gonna be jealous of? De oh, you think I'm gonna be jealous of Debbie? Debbie, do you really think I'm fucking jealous of you? Let's go low for a minute. Seriously? <laughs> Does anybody? Boy, that looks jealous to me. Shouty, I, I, I think maybe for maybe a second, maybe towards the middle. They might have, like, when they had the adult activities, possibly. But do I now? No. I think that if any given second, if we were sitting here right now and her phone rang, she would go pick him up. Does anybody think, let's just show of hands. Sorry, y'all, I can't do a pull because we're not on the computer. Who show of hands? Broti, welcome, love. Who t I said bro Who show of hands thinks that if the phone rang right this second and she said, yo guys, Didi kicked Natara. When you hear this clip today that where I'm gonna play of her saying, Didi, please leave him. Please leave him. Please leave him. Oh, dude, 100. Uh, yeah, I uh, I think so too. Get ready. Because you're gonna, when she says, y'all, look at the way when we get to this part, she says, please leave him, Dee Dee. Please leave him. Please. It's not like, oh my God, I'm scared. Chat, baby, welcome. Uh, uh, happy, welcome. It's not like, I am scared for, you know, when people were like, I think you should leave him. I'm scared for you. Reality, welcome, love. She's like, please leave him, Dee Dee. Please, please leave him. AF, welcome. Right, she's never done. Okay, so we're going to skip past this. Because we've already seen this, my friends. I wish I wouldn't have given money. Da-da-da-da-da. Da-da-da-da. Da-da-da. So let's take it. Eden, welcome. Let's take it. Look at this poor cat. Y'all, I seen last night. We were right about that greasy patch. Y'all remember the other night when I was like, is that the light shining or is that a greasy patch? Yep, it's a greasy patch. And sure enough, that little wine glass, that champagne glass was sitting there. Chantal, that is going to get knocked off by your cat's tail. And then you're going to have to worry. Yeah, Jolene, Jolene. Chantal, there's a song called Jolene by Dolly Parton. Might want to take a gandy. Or might not. So, what's going to happen is, the cat's going to knock the glass off. There's going to be glass all over the floor. Right, Robert? Buy a guitar, Chantal. But yeah. Stacy, welcome. Welcome everybody coming in. Thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed. It helps our little channel. Okay, so here we go. We are... Look at this beautiful outfit. Hold on, I gotta show you all this. I wore an exercise. Tizzy, thank you, love. I wore an exercise blue. Welcome. Um, like a nice, you know, V. Dude, wash this damn bra, Chantal. Hold on, y'all. The bra does not look comfortable. It's all bunched up in the back. Hold on, let's look at butt crack shorts. Okay, get ready for butt crack shorts. Here we go. So she's got these shorts on that are all up her asparagus, of course. 
Be dazzling. Welcome. Nice, Michaela. Do you have a channel? Be dazzling art with Michaela. Nice. Okay, get ready. These shorts are so far up her tail. I'm like, get the shorts out of your tail. Thank you, Happy. I'm glad to keep you guys entertained. I, I'm trying here. I'm, I'm I'm working with what we got here, guys. I'm, I'm trying. Nice, guys. Check out Be Dazzling Art with Michaela. Grebo, if you could drop, um, if you got, it, I know some of you guys clean or do other stuff if you're not busy. I got some things I want to be dazzle for um, a couple parodies. All right, here we go with butt crack, tail shorts. Get ready. I had to, I got to give you all the full shadow. Welcome, love. Fresh water. Fresh water here. He, uh... Hold on. Look he, at uh, this stupid on. glass. He waits patiently. Hold on, y'all. He... Sorry, and I'll fix it. Look at this glass, y'all. This is going to get knocked. Look, look at crack attack over here. Why do you listen? They're going to knock that glass over. Mark my words. I do not want to see it happen. I'm not. Sarah, welcome. Check out Sarah Locklear, guys. They're going to knock it over. I do not want to say it, and I do not want to see it happen, but they're going to knock it over. Just get a bowl and put the water in the bowl. You showed the cat bowl the other day. You were eating out of it. Get the bowl and put the water in. It's not that hard. Look at this. Chantal, it's not cute. It's frosty. Welcome. It's not cute. It's not bougie. It's, it's, they're going to knock it over is what's going to happen. And then you're going to have to take them to the vet if they step on it. And all because you want to try and look bougie or you're too lazy to wash a bowl. Jasper, welcome, love. Look at this, y'all. This glass is silly. It's stupid. Look at that. He freaks out, you know, waiting for her food. But he is extremely patient. <laughs> she probably freaks out because she is having to battle to get her food. Dude, these damn federales of police Chantal. Last night I was watching and they were mocking us. They were mocking us. They were like, see, ha, ha funny. Funny that, yeah, see guys, they were like how we say she gives Sam more attention. They was like, see guys, she's she's paying more attention to Sam. I'm like, dude, you 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 guys think you're funny, but you're really you're yeah, Peach Girl. That's what she's putting the cat's water in. Is a little champagne glass. Yeah. Chantal, you said it yourself. You can't get the cats in the car by yourself. So what happens if they knock this over? Cats don't like super small bulls because their whiskers are super sensitive and they will touch the sides. Thank you, Jay the Pie Thief. Right, Frosty? I'm like, just put the... It's not cute. It's not bougie. Put the damn water in a bowl. They're going to knock it over. What if you're ripped-y ripped one night when they knock it over? Oh, y'all, I didn't want to say it. Because there were some things going on the other night and people... She said, I'm going to go something about traveling or something. Don't quote me in the first part, but the second part, I do know 100. She said, I'll wait till your worm food. Grandma Spud, welcome, love. I'll wait till you're at least worm food. Dude, that shit is not funny in any shape, way, or form. 
I can't even imagine. Like, don't eat. I'm not even going to go there. Y'all know what I was about to say. Wait till they're worm food. Exactly situation. Disgusting. Why do you keep talking about death with your pets so much? It's gross. Wait till they're worm food? Who says that shit? But this is your queen, you guys, over there. The Federalis, the YouTube police. This is your queen. Exactly, Barbie C. Right, AF? Right? Oh, Trailer Park. If we did that shit in the States, man, it would be a wrap. Yeah. She's like, uh -huh, I'll wait till you're worm. I was like, dude, you're foul. You're the girl to move. You're just, you know, you're just hungry. I get it. Man, so are you. We don't get it. Oh, happy birthday to you. 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 Birthday. You ain't gonna say sorry to us, shit. You gotta wear it, not me. We did a wine stream? I don't think so. <laughs> did you like your chicken stew? Hmm. Yeah. Wine treat? I just give them like give her a couple and give them one or two. Now you have a full treat then? <laughs> but she's like thin, so I just don't mind over like overfeeding her. But she won't eat like if she's had enough. What am I gonna have for breakfast? I don't want to leave your tiny country town. <laughs> I'm glad you didn't bring it because I don't care. Like, I've already been here anyway. Like, I've already had my instincts were always there. This is why I dropped him off and said, Nope. Because I had a feeling like, Why is she so mad that you were with me? You know what I mean? And for you to come and throw a tantrum in her apartment, like, you have a tantrum. Did she say the word tantrum? I'm going to. Y'all don't. Did she say the word tantrum? Sorry, y'all. I was checking on my dogs. Did she say the word tantrum? Where'd you get that, Chantal? So we go back downstairs, and as you can see, we just can't let it go. Old non-frozen over here won't let it go. Majestic welcome, love. So you go all the way downstairs to talk about the same old shit. But the reason why we're going to watch this part is we're going to hear you, or excuse me, we're going to hear her talk about dissembling and about the calls. Where she slips up and says, he still answers my calls. I don't think she realized that she said that. And, of course, the majestic, um, VIE, Federale, uh, YouTube police, they don't even say nothing. Like, whoa, wait a minute. They're just happy that she's a new challenge woman and she's not eating 3,000 strawberry muffins and... She's not just, she's not going back to food, y'all. You guys, I know what you think. I'm going to go back to food because I'm done with these dudes. No, the dudes were done with you. I, but here we go. This is the part I was telling y'all about in the beginning. So we're, we're, we're down here, and here we go again. Here we go. Did you wonder why Dee Dee was calling Mrs. B? Welcome. Oh, I know. It's just like, yeah, she she's so done, but she's she, you can tell she's pissed right now in this. But but tell us again, Chantal, how you're done. Help me see the light. Fuck that shit. She's seen the light, Joe. He has nothing to lose. He always says to me, "Don't mess with something who has with someone who has nothing to lose." I won't mess with someone because that's the last thing you have to lose is my attention. The last thing that you have and judy if you're fine with a man looking at you being like you're not my type still using everything in your house including the bubble that's on you you are that's disgusting why would you say that no if you like that thing that's no problem but i know for me like that was one time i would never give you either i'm not gonna be the only man who not have it from me 
Okay, here you go. Let's discuss this. We've heard this a couple times now. Okay, let me ask you this. If you did not like something so much, okay? Help me make this make sense because it, it ain't making sense to me. If you didn't like something... Are you going to mention, hey, I don't like this, but I let my ex do it just to let you know? Anybody think that's a bit weird? Oh, no. We got static. Oh, gee, many. No. What is We were doing so good. I don't, I don't like something. But let me bring it up to you and let me tell you that my ex did it. You might find that a bit weird. A bit strange. Just when I play. Oh, I don't know what. Well, hopefully we can keep trucking. Why would you bring it up? Why would you tell him that you let BB do it? If I don't like something, I'm not going to let anyone do it. It's like you were almost bragging, in my opinion, to him that you let BB do it. Why bring it up? Exactly. That's another thing situation. I'm not going to be set here talking about all these holes if you catch my drift if I'm, I'm traumatized about it. And I'm not going to say, well, I let my ex do it, but of course a man, you know, is going to be like, well, I thought you didn't like it, but you let him do it. That would even like, wait a minute. You're not making sense here, dude. You're not. Exactly, Kim. Exactly. Exactly. All right, let's continue. You know, the birds are out here going hammer. So, you told him about... Okay, let's continue. Let's let's get this straight. Don't. Lunar, welcome, love. Oh, shoot. Ricky, I forgot. Sorry. I'll go for my list after. Maybe the random. Yes. What is, what is stuck to her eye right here? Is that a crustacean? Larky, welcome. Is that a... What? Do we got an eye crustacean? I didn't even notice that earlier. We got a crustacean on deck. I believe them. He lied to me. I believe them. But now, it confirmed you were a super big fat liar. Like, even if by some miracle... Even by some miracle... He got acquitted on all charges. Bunny Melon, welcome. Welcome, everybody coming in. Thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed. It looks... Now it looks like a piece of crust. He came to me and was like, I'm so sorry, I'm so truly sorry, and he went to all the anger management. The fact that you fucking, even all, anything else aside, the fact that you lied to me for so long, I will never, ever, ever, you'll never see this face in public ever again. You'll never hear my voice. I'll never make another fucking thumbnail for you ever again. <laughs> it was like repeatedly. I'm so much better. So yeah, I might be going through a lot of hurt from realizing what, that, what you've done to me. None of my emotions are, have any tenderness for you at all anymore. <laughs> Realizing where I went through, which is why I'm even still talking about it. Like, this oh serves me right now. This gosh, serves me to talk about oh. Not you. That's the difference. I will no longer talk about you to serve you, to stroke your ego, to, to lie for you, like, what's your face has to. <laughs> you said you wanted to get food before the threesome, so she recommended a sex talk. But she was making fun of your weight. Who is she to talk? She's not one to talk at all. At least, like, fucking, like, seriously. I won't even go there. He you your attention and wanted to raise just fucking me there. Yeah, the other thing you keep making any sort of the middle of the thing in life. Was it something? Not really, actually. I, it was okay, but it was like a pepperoni style or something. I don't know. Maybe time to do a panel and roast him. Yeah, right. Yeah. I could bury him. Like, with all the information I have, like, he's, he's told me himself. So you're burying yourself, pal. Like, he has nothing against me. Like, I've always been honest with him. I hate the fact that I never cheated on him. Up until Renee, I never fucked another man. Never. You piece of shit. I wish I did. But, 
I promised myself I would never cheat on another person that I love again, and I didn't. So here we go, Dee Dee. <laughs> right? Doo Doo is her name. <clears throat> Play Eye of the Tiger. The audio proves you were not lying. Thank you, Tracy. Stabby claiming B2 pathetic attempt to save channel. Thank you, Veneer Pondu. Absolutely. I need to get some more. My next grocery list will have Veneer on it. <laughs> Hi, B3 says I'm okay. It's not just your weight, you have asthma, so they're showing someone with an illness as well. Oh, Jesus. <clears throat> Can we get some documentation? DH, welcome. Ray Ray, welcome everybody coming in. Dude, I have asthma since a child. Carletta, welcome. They're making fun of... Oh, my God. Nicole, welcome. Chantal, get over. Guntel, welcome, love. Dude, get out of here. I got asthma. Are you, Dude, you just want to find anything. Lara, welcome. You want to find anything that you can just be the victim of. Anything. Rachel, welcome. I believe... Harley, welcome. Chantal, if somebody made fun of me because I had asthma, I'd be like, really? What a seriously... You gotta be joking. Like... I would laugh because nobody can handle asthma. Terry, welcome. Chantal, you, I don't even think she has asthma. Again, that's my opinion. I'm not a doctor. I simply think, Riri, welcome. It's the weight. Um, I never heard anything about this asthma. Nancy, welcome, love. I never heard anything about this. But, um go on. Chantal, get over. If somebody laughed that I had asthma or, like, get out of here. Quit being a little cry. You're, you're being a you know what I'm gonna say. Gee, many Christmas. Man, Bernard, welcome. Great to see you. Here's another thing, Chantal. You allegedly claim that you're allergic to cats, but yet you don't run the sweeper, you don't dust, you don't vacuum, so half your not being able to breathe, stylish, welcome. Half your, Debbie, why welcome, Candy, welcome. Half your breathing could be your sucking in all this cat dander. You ever think of that? Do you ever think that you just said your head wrap literally was covered in cat hair? Sorry, guys. YouTube Rejects Live, welcome, y'all. Check out YouTube Rejects Live. Yeah. Look, look at the cat here on this hat. Look at that. You're the one that's got to live in this shit. Not us. Not us. Man, Robert, cat hair. Man, it takes my breath away. It really does. I don't mind having some mobility issues. I like, is that a flex? I would not. I would rather be. I would rather be in any situation other than theirs. Like, I could not imagine her being her. I couldn't stand it. I had fucking anxiety every fucking time I was around him. I don't miss it. A chia pet, you know, right? I'd rather look like a chia pet than a fucking dummy bummer. You know why you're... Matters in panic because all his moms like Jessica left. Gonna make fun of child essay. See? Blame yourself for Jessica leaving. Blame yourself for... I told you. I told you this would happen. Every single person will leave you because... You don't, you treat people in your life like shit. You so you. do you. Dude, I, I, the dude is a piece of sh You are, where's your crew? Where's your crew at? Sarah Jane's pissed at you. Had your back through thick and thin. Sandy and Ange. Kimikaze's over here. Lara's over here. I talked to Eric. Where's your crew at? And then you're talking about, oh, a haircut like Dumb and Dumber. Dude, you're clearly not over it. You're clearly Chantal S. Welcome. Yeah, where's Marissa? Where's Shannon? Dirty Diana, welcome. You, Where's your crew at? Where is your crew? And talking about Sarah Jane's mom with cancer, man, you don't bring... Family and kids ain't got shit to do with this. 
Lara, everybody had your back. Sarah Jane, Sandy and Ange, don't really like Sandy and Ange, but I'm going to say it, had your back. They would come over here with their little coffee vampire. Remember when we called out Bay Nation one day? Everybody had your back. Multiple, Melanie, welcome. Multiple people gave you chance after chance after chance. And finally people said, look, I can't stand with this. I can't stand with this. I can't. After the Texas thing, after the Cuba rage, after you falsifying police reports, they said, look, I can't stand with this. They've gave S-Jam. Look what you did to S-Jam. Shelbel, the KFC is the Knights of Chantal. The Knights of Chantal in, yes, yeah, Sandra. How many times did me and Sandra kind of tit for tat sometimes in here? The Knights of Chantal. They are going to go to other people's comment section, which is against terms of service, and comment other people's comment section about Chantal. You cannot have a group, you cannot have a cult, you cannot have a gang that goes to other people's channels to harass them. You are not the YouTube police. I'm telling you, DG, and welcome. All right, so let's hear, and that's another thing. Chantal, look, she can't just say, she's going to, oh, dumb and dumber, and did, oh, my God, Frosty, embarrassing, and they are eating it up. They think it is the cutest thing ever. I've put a KOC in my name. Aren't you guys? I joined, guys. Well, guess Francis, welcome. Guess what? It's against terms of service to incite to go to other people's chats. And thank you, Trailer Park and Tish. Sam, since you don't like Sam so much, the Sam, the double swords, that's Sam's Teflers thing. And it's been for years. So, boom, there you go. So let's 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 hear for the 50th time. Of what, uh, you know, she's she's so over him, guys. Let's let's hear she's so. And by the way, this is a one point five. They did that to copy F. See, they just they can't come up with their own ideas. Oh, DG, if they come here, it's I try not to block anybody, but they will be blockerooski with the quickness. I ain't got no patience today. Yes, Nick Kinnear, there's last night was making sorry looking. Did you make Kinnear? He had to lock DD down after everyone turned on him. So he's just he's waiting to claim you to see what I was gonna do. How does that make you feel? No, dude, he, he did it because of Gary and the deflection. deflection. He's very aggressive. I don't miss that energy. Even just watching it, that's why I don't want to watch it. The pink slip is him fucking going to prison. That's what his pink slip is. <laughs> I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm waiting to be arrested for, for outing your abuse. It's his own mouth that ruins it. Absolutely. She encouraged him to scam me out of an apartment. Nope. I don't care. She's the one being scammed, ironically. How did she make that make sense? Is anybody confused with that? Sean, welcome. She encouraged him to scam you out of an apartment. Dee Dee, okay, let's get this straight. I cannot stand all three of them. But let's let's go ahead and make this make sense. Jersey, welcome. Okay, welcome. Okay, let's make this make sense. Dee Dee, somebody in the chat said, Dee Dee encouraged him to scam. Dee Dee has her own house or condo. What does Dee Dee give two shits if Chantal would have got him an apartment? How's that going to benefit Dee Dee? Dee Dee's not going to move in a place that's paid for, for a place that you got to pay rent. Make that, I'm not riding for Dee Dee. Carletta, welcome, because I'm sick of all their 
he asks. But make that, are, are you going to leave a place that you don't have to pay no rent to go to a place and this character's name, I believe that nobody could get a cosigner. I believe that nobody could get the lease in their name. That's what I believe. I believe Natter couldn't get the lease in his name and she couldn't get the lease. Excuse me. That's what I think. I think that they were having trouble figuring out who was going to co-sign for this mess. She put up a bunch of new community posts. Okay, we'll check them out after because I'm afraid if I turn on our other device, that's when static starts hitting the fan. She said, well, I, I had the place put in Pete's name. Truth, it's not. Because when I went to get the loan for my uncle's house and went to rent that other house a couple months ago, I told you, they were like, I'm sorry, but we can't, we can't count the YouTube with it. We can't. Exactly, DG. He didn't care about that. Part. Like the other day, did y'all hear say, all we needed was a bed and kitchen utensils. We're going to justice... Journey of Justice, welcome. All we needed was a bed and Kencho kitchen utensils, guys. That's that's how it was gonna be. They don't, Rachel. You have to go do it yourself. Yeah. That's why she's so far because she doesn't pay her taxes. Yeah, you have to go pay your own taxes. So I will give Amber Lynn one thing she's smart of is keeping money back for the taxes. I'll give Amber Lynn that. That I will give her. I, Frosty, I don't think so either. See, I know something. And I was sworn, and I cannot... I'm loyal. I'm just going to beat around the bush and take this I've kind of hinted around for what you will. I know something, but I'm loyal and I can't do it to somebody. Chantal was making bank for a minute. Chantal allegedly, and this is for entertainment purposes only, when Chantal came back to YouTube, she was still hitting hard. She was sweating balls, allegedly, because that last check, allegedly, was a bankroll. Allegedly. Take it for what you will. It was a, it was a hunk and chunk in money, allegedly, for entertainment purposes only. It was a hunk and chunk in I would have been sweating my asshole, too. Be scammed? You will be scammed. Dee Dee, this man abused me and used me for a whole year and you've seen it. And you're still going to support him? Good on you. Let's you're at the looking glass. Welcome up. And I'm telling y'all, right quick, and this is again for all entertainment purposes only, take what this what you will. Believe me or don't. When she talks about this money that some people don't believe, she's serious. She's serious. And I can say, again, I gotta watch my own ass. She's serious. She's serious. Again, this is for entertainment purposes. Miss Piggy, welcome. Did you hear Dee Dee Audio? She admitted they were all in a contract relationship. Where is that at, Mrs. Piggy? We got to find that. Canby, welcome. Again, this is for entertainment purposes only. This is not facts. These are me and my chat's opinion. Sherry V, welcome. Where's this clip at, y'all? I fell asleep early last night. 
Okay, we'll check it out after this. Sam's Bar. Okay. Sam's Bar and Lounge channel. Okay, we'll check that out next. For justice. Enough said. Enough said. There's nothing to say space, but in reaction, whatever. They were the whole time they were together. Nothing new. Just confirming his lies. He's so disrespectful in her house, it literally pisses me off putting his feet on her kitchen counter and not letting her sleep. Did he make paneer? <laughs> what an asshole! No, I'm kidding. When she gets sick of him, he'll throw a fit or get violent. I'm so glad. Look, I'm Did he make paneer what a soul? Does that sound Tennessee? Welcome. Does that sound Andy? Welcome. Welcome everybody coming in. Does this sound like somebody that's done? Did he make paneer? Soul. Speaking of y'all, I almost bought it, but I put it back because I'm gonna make that TikTok tomorrow, that feta pasta with the cherry tomatoes. I seen paneer cheese today nice af i seen paneer cheese and i was like no no make this and then we'll get that um but um i'm gonna make that tiktok feta pasta and i got tomatoes at the farmer's market basil and parsley and all that only thing i had to go to the store to get was the feta angel cake welcome so yeah yeah, Frosty, it does look rich as I'll get up. Okay, y'all, let's keep going. Right, stylish Irish, or er, stylish, stylish Irish Trish. Sorry, I was trying to say. Yeah, they're all three. It's, it's, but she's not done, you can tell. She's not done, in my opinion. She, she, she cannot let it go. Y'all are going to hear, we're going to keep rolling and listen to this where she says, I don't even think she catches herself. Can you show us that TikTok video later? I'll tell you what we'll do, Journey. We'll, we'll get through this and then we'll do another stream. We'll haul a couple things. I'll show you what I got at the farmer's market and then we'll discuss the, um, filthy animal. Welcome. We'll discuss the, um, recipe. And we'll, we'll, we'll talk about all that. Let, let's knock this out so it's not a million hours long. I don't even know if this is still live. But I want y'all to hear when she says he still answers my phone calls. Big Mama, welcome. Thumbs up, y'all. Make sure you're subscribed. Welcome, everybody coming in. Welcome, everybody chilling in the background. What I would be going through if I did move in with him. He looks like he's doing interpretive dance while he's raging. It's not your problem. You. So you think you're going to sue me? Because, bitch, I can get you for coercion. So don't even go there. And it, it really was. I had to, like, I was so desperate to talk to him. I had to, every time I tried to call him, she would answer and be in the middle of it. Mm -hmm. Okay, sorry. One more pause and then I'm going to go pee pee in the kitchen. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I hate to keep doing that to y'all. Chantal, let it go. It's done. It's over. You dropped the case. You falsified police reports. Was Dee Dee in the wrong? Absolutely. This is where you need to learn the law. This is where it's too late. Everything you say can and will be held against you. At least that's how it is in the United States. You came on here. I think we've got it. Misunderstood. Welcome. I'm sure 50 other channels have it. Let it go. You just said literally... That I wanted to talk to him so bad. Boom. It's done. It's over. Thank you. You filed a false police report. You can't go back and say, well, I have the hotel receipts. You were in there with them. It doesn't matter. You were in there with them. You are just as guilty as he is to them. It's done. It's over. It it, it makes you do do what you you drove him to that hotel. She's like, I I I I still have the receipts to the last time we hung out at the hotels. Okay, you bought the hotel. You went there with them. What, what's that? What, what's that mean? You're just as guilty. You, if you really had a protection order, you broke it. 
You said yourself. Oh, I wasn't supposed to be getting a hold of Dee Dee neither. You broke it. There's no, there's no case for none of y'all. But you go ahead and spend some of that money. Go ahead. Guys, I'm going to go pee right quick. None of y'all got a case. Uh-oh, here we go. What's Podusty got brewing for us today, y'all? Hold on, y'all. Christina, welcome, love. But Dussie's moist, I drip dry on Natty's head. What is up, love? Great to see you. Great to see you. Welcome, everybody, coming in. And if you won the last giveaways, as soon as the tubes drop, I got everything boxed up. That is the first thing I'm going to do. So I added some extra things to it. Do not worry. That is the first things I've got on the list, and I've got everything, and I even added more. So, let's get to it. Let's do it. Oh, man, y'all, I should have went to Target while I was out today. Dag on it. Yeah, I should have went to Target. Right? <laughs> Christina Moy. All right, y'all, I'm going to go pee right quick. Vegas, welcome, love. Yeah. Yeah, like Jesse, welcome. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh no, I'm gonna do my own story time. All right, y'all. I'll be right back. I'm gonna go pee right quick. I'm not gonna be able to check on y'all, so be good. Um, usually I turn on the other device, but I don't want to get static, so I notice that's when it gets staticky. So give me about two minutes, pee, check on the wobbles, and I'll be right back. Sam, Sam, welcome, love. Do you want a kiss? No, I don't. You are cold and clammy everywhere. You know, one thing, knock it off. Okay, wait a minute. Hold on while I'm standing up. Okay, if I don't do something, I don't do it. But you went back for more. So you got nothing to stand on when you, well, you don't stand up anyways. No pun intended. But does anybody do something here? And then they go back for more if they don't like it. Not me. You said that you slept with them. I don't know if it's two. I know it's two, but it might be three times. I know it's two, you said. So it couldn't have been that bad. Couldn't have been that bad if you went back for more. Just saying. I, I, it's pointless when she says that. You're cold. You're clammy. Me, me, me. You went back for more. You stayed the night there, dude. Knock it off. You, you, you make no sense. The only people that are believing you about about the 10, 15 people of your federales of the YouTube police. Everybody else is over the shit. Oh, and, and people, look at her skin here. You want to know her skin routine? Oh, your skin's so beautiful. What's your routine? Sherry, welcome, love. It's called Samsung Filters. Stick that in a bottle and stick it on your skin. I'm wearing stonewashed mom jeans. They both make me want to curl. Uh, okay. At least she it. wears jeans. She almost did. Prison art. Is it legal for them to record all their calls? I don't know. No, I never understood Dom's sub dynamic. No one can ever tell me what to do, especially not a contract. <laughs> it's true! Uh... <laughs> she was cold and clean me. Yes, I'm not making up. And I threw up several times. Bless him, he had to keep repeating he didn't cry when he got arrested. That's what Dean's told me. He saw his message. He was crying when he was putting cuffs. You cried when you found out I fucked Renee in Cuba. You put on those fake snaky chameleon friggin' tears, didn't you? You know what? Now I get why she was mad and freaking out. He even, he's such a, he has to, he has to, it must be exhausting for you to have to keep all your life straight. Because whenever you didn't tell Didi you were just going to hop in the car, go to the hotel with me when you weren't supposed to, Didi called and went, what are you doing? What about my feelings now? He instantly to keep his life straight. Like, she's concerned, like, the immediate thing, he didn't think of her feelings. He thought right away to keep his life straight by saying, she's mad because she's my friend and she doesn't want me to get in trouble. No, she's mad because you're not giving her the D and the gelée tonight. That's why, you fucking liar. <laughs> it's true! I'm over their shit. I'm so over their shit. I'm so thankful that I'm over their shit. And... 
This was so beautiful. I believe in your story never changed. No, it doesn't. I never lied about anything that any of those events. If you think I lied about something, I can have a truth hour later. I feel like going on a panel and being questioned later. Oh, Gelé is the French version of lube. He, he, he goes to, I can just picture it. Go, hey, can you go get some lube at Jean Tu Lavo? Ew. Like, you're really gonna brag about this? Like, get to my balls. Your fucking purple mattress, your room is probably full of cigarettes and sardines. I'm not jealous. Thank you! Even if you did lie about some truths, it was obvious that you were gonna throw it into it. Oh, well, the thing I lied about, I had never thrown about them for him, yeah. She gets diarrhea when she sees me because she gets nervous. <laughs> what? Why? Oh, oh, can I be on the panel too? <laughs> yes. The only sardine in the room is between matters like, ew, yeah, true. Yeah, the, real... the only fish stick is your fish stick. I used to have a friend. She used to say her, her boyfriend's mirror smelled like fish stick. It was a fish stick. She used to call it that. So, there you go. We need new sick beats about this situation. Oh! It's going to be called Jelly. I have to compliment you. You are dealing with this better than me. I choose to get into fights during my abuse. It was the only way I could get out of my question. Look, if I was actually mad, I would be raging. But I just can't. I just don't feel it, you know? I don't rage. I, I mean, if I don't feel like raging, I don't feel like raging. So, I'm just saying I appreciate it. There's nothing to be proud of. Because if I was mad, I would be raging. Probably. I'm not choosing not to rage right now. I just don't care. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm fucking doing a panel. Hi, Jay Boy! I would have been locked up by now. See, like, I'm not with him. Like, if he, if I was with him and he hit me one more time, I would be locked up. I would absolutely be locked up. Because I would get it back, I would give it back to him and he would not be getting out of there. No. Because I would be like, I probably would have snapped. I don't know. I don't know. I could venture you go for it. Humans have limits, man. No, I didn't see her. Ugh. No wonder, the, the, the only way you trap people is with your green peen. You trap these women with your green peen and it's the only thing. You, you, you claim to be a good lover, but really all you are is selfish. Selfish lover. Who initiates lovemaking with suck my dick? No foreplay, nothing. He said it was her idea for another to scan the next world. Yeah, actually, I can show her seats. He actually didn't get all that, that, that much money out of me. Like the last time I sent him that 500 bucks, and then he asked me for like he was downtown drunk and needed money for cigarettes, like I posted. But I was like, I'm broke too, sorry. Like I started telling him, like, I'm broke too. I was thinking about cooking. And I was actually gonna, like, I was like making sure I had money aside for like first and last month's rent. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. I hate my. I I don't like to deal with in therapy on Monday. Like, I hate myself right now for allowing myself to be fucking used like that. You spent thousands on food, smokes, petrol, gifts. Yeah, you're right, Charlotte. Rent? I paid his rent for like three months, I think. Wait a minute. Gray Twiggy alien really smokes Wait. two packs a day. Gray Twiggy alien smokes two packs a day. Wait a minute. Can somebody do a quick, here, let's, let's do it, and then let's take a quick community break. Okay, wait a minute. Anybody catch that? Therapy, what's the date? Therapy on Monday? She said the therapy was scheduled, the earliest she could get it was the 28th. Hold on a second, what's the date today? What's the date today? Hold on, y'all. Let's take a community tab pause. Y'all said... Today's... Yeah, today's the 16th. I had to... I had to delete the... I had to delete the... See, she said... Maybe I got it wrong... Monday is the 18th. I swore she... Maybe I'm wrong. My bad, Joe. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe the doctor... I swore she said the therapy was the 28th. But she just said... Mon, maybe I'm wrong. Well, I... I don't know, y'all. Okay, hold on. Let's bust open the community tabs. Yo, she streamed for... Three hours, 47 minutes, and 27, almost four hours. Okay, here we go. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Quiet if you, I thought she said the 28th too, Great Grebo. Okay. Quiet if anybody's already seen it. Anybody want to have an idea what the community tab's about? Any ideas?
Anybody got an idea? Centerly welcome. Don't, if you haven't seen it, shh. Those that haven't seen it, like me, what do you think the community have? Christina for the win. Yo. Okay. One low blow. I love you guys. You are like 1K best friends. You are like the 1K best friends telling me my ex is ugly just to make me feel better. Well, Chantal, I know that you think that this is... But uh, it's still considered, again, I'm not writing for Dee Dee. I'm just saying for YouTube, this is still considered bullying and harassment. Again, I cannot stand neither of these three, but I'm saying as YouTube terms of service. Claudia, welcome. So somebody made a thing of Donald Trump kissing Natter, and here we go. So Chantal, let me tell you, it's still, you're going to end up losing your channel. Diane, welcome. So there's the good old community tab. Oh, it's funny. I'm sure you didn't even make that. Somebody else. Yeah, the Joker hair green, but you know somebody made this for her. The other day, she's like, if, if you guys want to make any new badges, you're more than welcome. I should probably learn how to do that, huh? Do, do, you, do you want them just to make the videos for you? Now, again, I don't know how to edit, but you know how to edit some stuff. The other day, it said double-click to edit, and you forgot to double-click to tap it. Sophia, welcome, love. So, you'll take time to put this shit up. Here you go, VIEs. There's one for you. She'll take time to put this up, but she won't take the time to make you new badges. Let that sink in. Let that sink in. Right? Exactly, uh, Melanie. Chantal, you're going to end up losing your channel over these two is what's going to happen. Mrs. Havasu, or Havasum, welcome. Yeah, it's it's like, dude, you're... Okay, let's move on. Really? This is, this is what you're focusing on. No, I didn't, it says. The best part of Chantal rating... The fridge. That's how you know the story was 100% accurate. Sam's Bar and Lounge laughing. No, I didn't. What does that mean, y'all? The best part... The best part was Chantal raiding the fridge. That's how you know the story was 100% accurate. No, I didn't. Holy moly, welcome. It was her VIB Apple Beezers asked them to e she asked them to email her the pick. Wow. Chantal, you're gonna end up you're gonna end up getting yourself a beats and a pickle. Oh my gosh, y'all. Fifteen minutes ago. O M F G. You guys were right. I didn't think he was smart enough to be an actual calculating scammer. But this theory makes a lot of sense, dot, 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 sorry. All this is, is really close up, and I'm seeing reality, and it is overwhelming, but it helps to share these realizations. And it's a thing about May. Somebody says, when May first went to the police... Stabacabra pretended to be FB's boyfriend. So convenient that he is less than three weeks away from court and now all of a sudden is Barney Rubble's new boyfriend. But Barney genuinely thinks it's love. Keep coming, keep them coming, Jennifer. What Stabacabra didn't, what Stabacabra did to you and Pretty is so low, make sure you get your vindiction. Vindiction. Chantal, leave the May situation alone. Leave it alone. List, welcome. Leave it alone. You welcome. You guys see, I don't really touch the May situation too much because what have I always said? 
I'm not the crown. I'm not the jury. I'm not the judge. I don't want no part in none of that shit. Exactly, Jesse. It's like, dude, she just, she brings, just like Gary today, or yesterday, she brings this up when it's beneficial to her. Just like Vegas the other day. They was like, why does Vegas girl keep going live when Foodie Beauty's live? Holly, welcome, love. Vegas can go live whenever she wants. Vegas isn't in a contract with Foodie. Angela, welcome, love. There's like, I think Vegas, though. Vegas, I forget which one it was. They was like, why does Vegas, it's like she's doing it on purpose. Vegas can go live Whenever she wants, she's on a different time frame. Tiny, welcome. Vegas doesn't have to. She can go live whenever she wants. Oh my God, Joe. 19 minutes go. Why did I allow this in my life? Another somebody's comment she hearted. Hour of the Clowns, trying to, profu, prof, trying to prove that Chantal is the crazy one and they were just friends. Wow. They are most disgust they are the most disgusting people ever. She admitted to lying to her mother and was sleeping with them, so Chantal was right about everything. No wonder why Chantal literally lost her mind. These people are evil. Vegas, I'm not quite for sure, love. It was last night or the night before. I fell asleep and I, I'm not it was last night or the night before. I forget who it was, Vegas. I honest to God do. Dude, Chantal, in my opinion, is, you know. But Chantal, I've said this before, is you are in charge of yourself. You are in charge of your mental health. Also, now everybody's been saying this all along, but now Chantal is not the crazy one. Chantal is still talking about this. Exactly, Vegas. And who cares what time you go live? AR, welcome. You can go live whenever you want. No wonder why Chantal literally lost her mind. Listen, Chantal could check out of this situation any time she wants. She still, as we're watching her, just got off live, literally, and still continues to discuss this. Chantal drove herself over there. So, yes, in my opinion, she done, dude, you don't keep driving back. You don't keep driving back. And again, we said earlier, I feel like she would whistle over there right now. Wait to the part when you look at her eyes when we hear this part about, please, Dee Dee, leave him. Please. It's not for being sincere to Dee Dee. It's because she, wait till y'all see this part. I'm going to find it right now. It's not because she's scared about Dee Dee's. She's not concerned for Dee Dee. Amanda, welcome. Right, Robert? You're not saying that because you are sincere. You're saying that because you want him to leave her. Reset, welcome. Oh my gosh, oh, 20 minutes ago. Beware who you allow your time to in life. Hard AF lessons crying emoji. Oh my gosh, yo. These are all... I thought you didn't like books, Chantal. I thought you didn't like when people wrote books, but it's okay if it's kissing your ass. So, somebody says... So, she admitted that the threesome happened and he had slept with Chantal in the past. We all thought he had slept with Chantal. Was that a mystery for anybody we knew he was bagging her out, getting a thousand, a couple thousand a month. We knew that. We said it. And that he and Chantal were together. Also, the restraining order was not for Chantal. It was for Natter. We knew that as well. He broke it regardless under what circumstances 
or if he was begged. He broke the restraining order, which is chargeable criminal offense, period, period. Edit. There is no one they wouldn't lie to. The fact that Dee Dee and Natter lie so easily and convincingly shows they're sociopaths. Chantal, add yourself in that boat. Second off, it doesn't... Chantal, when there is a restraining order, Island Girl, welcome. You are not supposed to see him either. It is against you, therefore, you're not supposed to see him either. Yo. Oh my gosh, yo. 30 minutes ago. Oh, I, you see, this is great. Island Girl, thank you, love. This is great. So, Jennifer Corvina, she said, was the girl from the well movie and this, that. I would like to sincerely thank... Agent Jennifer Corvina and Nader Al Shami in all this. Corvina, your FBI work or your FBI work has been amazing here. And Mr. Al Shami, thank you for screwing over the wrong woman. Love that for you. Sam's Bar and Lounge, Dee Dee leaked audio discussing threesome with Natter and Foodie Beauty. Get ready. 30 set dude. Look at this. It, it just goes on and on. Is this somebody that you're done with? L-M-O. Whoever this is, I sincerely love you. The ghost of Natter's Paneer. Four hours ago. Oh, my God. Look, I thought you hated books, Chantal. Dude, you're getting so desperate to make me jealous to get views. We been knew that you were a lure. What's a lure? A lure this whole time, and this just confirms it. Hey, I had to kiss her, too, but it was cold and clammy. You didn't have to do shit. You didn't have to do nothing. You chose to. Oh my gosh. My turn to put you in your place again. Nah. Everyone sees how you were an essay shamer abuser. Who is probably going to prison but keep plowing. You spelled plowing wrong Chantal Dee Dee. Looks like you are kissing your father here. With Jean. I don't even know Glee. No one cares. Uh, I think you do care, bud. You are evil and gross and smell of smoke. Well, you know what? I probably might smell a little bit of smoke, too. But I'd rather smell than smoke of tuna fish. This was your next supply set up the whole time. Now you can freely admit to your lies because you've lost me for good. And now you realize it and can't be open and free about your relationship with Grandma Doodoo. Congratulations, guys. Dude, you are obsessed. Obsessed. Martino, welcome, love. Yeah. Chantal, why do you want to throw around like your roommate is talking about transitioning? Why do you keep talk calling Dee Dee a man? You don't think that that probably like put two and two together. All right, so let's refresh. Okay. So, she just thinks it's great. Her little following, 96, thumbs up, 37, 47, 56, 46, 51. God, dog, y'all. Chanto, you are obsessed. Obsession. Her subscribers, she's at 92.4. I do think that literally you... Keep getting more subs. Stinky, welcome. Gemma, welcome. 
I don't think so either, lovely. I think that I'm not even going to go there, but Chantal, you're not looking ravishing here yourself. You've been worn this sports bra for, yeah, obsessed is definitely obsession to the max with the capital. Yes, we're going to watch that. Um, We'll watch that video. All right, let's get into this. Is this make sure, y'all, this is at 1.5. Can you imagine this at regular speed? Thank you, JC. Can y'all imagine this at regular speed? It's It seems like it's in regular speed, y'all. Good. I, I want y'all to hear the part about still in the, like, still calling. And, um, I'm telling you not a gamer. She's like, I don't like books. Anybody, any, Mary Beth, welcome, love. I don't like books. Anybody that leaves book comments, I don't read them. I can't tell. Probably. I hate. Right, Martina? Like, oh my goodness. Uh, look at that. Beautiful screenshot. You think I'm going to miss that? You think I'm going to miss your gross fucking, don't hate yourself if you've learned from it, which I think you have. Thank you. Oh, yeah, which I from. think you. It's cool to see you not care like just. They literally just said they think that she has learned of it. Uh, You might want to go check out her community tab, buddy, because I don't think she's learned nothing. You might want to look at the post uh, over and over and over and watch this video, but hey, who am I? Cut your losses. Actually. What are Congratulations. You You're going to need it. Cord cutting. What are you cutting? Your clothes up? Natter, goodbye. What the hell is that, Joe? That was so easy. Look, this is your life. Threads. Dude, you're, you're insulting me using my iPad. You're so. You just said the other day that. What the hell was that? Did you just cut your underwear? What? I'm confused. She lost a tooth. I'm confused. What? I don't know what it was. Was it her underwear? Was it a dish towel? Yeah, Christine, I'm saying, though, what was she cutting? What? Hold on, y'all. I'm lost. Patricia, welcome. What did you just cut? You said the other day that you had no dish towels. Sensational, welcome. Oh, Chantal, why are you cutting up stuff? What even was that, y'all? You need to quit. Yeah, let me stop. Cut everything up. Screw it. Cut that dirty-ass couch up. Sarcastic, it looked like a pair of underwear or a dish towel or a scarf or... I don't even know what it was, y'all. Hold on, let's go back a smidgen. What the hell was that? It looks like a scarf or... Look at... Hold on, y'all. Why would you cut? She just waste shit to waste shit. What are you doing? Cutting them into dish towels? You Hey, you might want to keep those, Chantal. You might want to keep those. I don't know what it is, y'all. Chantal, you might want to keep those and use those. Yeah, you you might want to you might want to keep those. Maybe bobbleheaded. It's I can't tell. Chantal, that's not what cutting Oh my gosh, y'all. Cord cutting. Oh, you're so Natter, goodbye. That was so easy. <laughs> Look, this is your life. Threads. That's your Threads. life, too. You're, using, you're insulting me using my iPad. But I still pay for it for you. Dude, okay. I can't stand the guy, but the iPad was a gift, Dingle. I cannot stand the guy, but the freaking, right, Christina? That was edgy. This is your life, guys. Yeah, this is your life, Chantal. I cannot stand the dude, but the iPad, you bought him. You said it. You literally said, I bought it. V, welcome, love. I bought it for him for Christmas. You said it. That's your fault for financing it, making five figures allegedly a month. Who does that? Who, you guys, honestly, let's be real here. 
if you were making, allegedly, five figures on a high note, allegedly, would you finance a measly-ass iPad? Susan, welcome. Why would you finance that shit? Hands, welcome. Why wouldn't you just buy it outright? You're paying more by financing it. Right, Tiny? That, too. Dude, Chantal, you're paying interest on... Yeah, cheaper to buy it outright. That's your own silly-ass fault for still paying on that thing. Family. You're living in her condo. So what? You don't even really want to be there. You hate your life. You're going to prison. You're on trial for sexual assault. Your life. I don't feel bad for you. See ya. My life, I can travel to Europe. Why am I going to be mad at them? Enjoy your life together. <laughs> uh, he's burning food daily. <laughs> Quick paying. Oh, no. I haven't paid in a long time. Roddy mom. Yes, Manny. It just makes me happy, too. Cutting ties. Yep. I think he was you guys, Chantal looks thrilled, doesn't she? She looks happy as hell to me. For like seven or eight months. I did record it still when they cut the service. I thought we'd never get here. He just said you act like his life only started when he met you. He also said he used to work at a prison. Now here's, well, here's what you're going to be missing out. Since you fucking used and abused me. I mean, who, like, honestly, like he had it made. I don't even have to go over it again. Nobody okay, has it made hanging hungry. out with you. Do you remember all those like fruits and how his counter was all fresh fruits and but I used to fucking ignore my life for you. I used to fucking ignore <laughs> Guys, I am bowling, okay? I've got downstairs, I've got peaches from the farmer's market. I might have an old ass avocado down there. I just got some cherry tomatoes, some parsley, and some basil. I am balling, y'all. Chantal, did you just flex some fruits and vegetables? Did you just say, you had, remember his counter with the fruits and vegetables? You know what, guys? I may be in hell in debt, but I'm balling out because I got some fruits and veggies. We are in there, y'all. Oh, my goodness, y'all. You guys, Chantal will just... She's one of a kind. She can buy you fruits and vegetables unlike yourself. Oh, lovely. When she was eating that barbecue sauce the other day trying to act all dainty, I was like, get out of here with that mess. Record all your videos, edit them nice. You were making at least ten thousand on a video. Edit them nice. Good luck now. But you know what? Edit them nice. Welcome, Iron. Edit them nice. Dude, you played a song at the beginning and add a couple. Dude, anybody here, let's talk about this. Sorry, I promise I'll keep it quiet after this. I'm telling you, filthy animal, you are we are rich over here. We've got fruits and vegetables. I'm telling you. What are you talking about? I don't know how to edit, but I want to make this clear. You played a little music in the beginning and added a couple words. Exactly. Jaden, er, the editing, again, I don't want to, you know, because I don't know how to edit. And you guys know that. But I've watched m tons of cooking videos. Chantal, you, your editing is par, par, subpar, right, Christina? She's making it rain with fruits and veggies and, oh my gosh, y'all, this is great. I didn't hear this part. Nothing, this is, this is all your fault. Every problem you have right now in your life is all your fault. Yours as well. As well. Oh, okay, you too. <clears throat> okay. Type of guy to go to jail and then claims he's just there for work. Stop it, Nikki. <laughs> he cooked in prison. He never told me that. Don't flex. He was never a person deserving of any of it. You're the winner here. 
Yes. Yeah. Like all I ever did, I'm guilty of loving him. Like I never, and I'm guilty of not loving myself. Absolutely, this is what you get. This is what you get when you don't love or respect yourself. Abuse, abuse, well, yeah. But women, there are strong, resilient women. I hate when women, people, I hate when people say, now I know. I never understood why. I always thought women who, who never left an abusive relationship were weak. Now I know, and I know that these women are actually strong to put up with that shit. We're just very loving and forgiving. Yes. It's bittersweet having it all confirmed, absolutely. But I'm surprised myself that I just don't care, because I can't be jealous. Because I've kissed her, so I know what it's like, and I don't care. And him too, I know what it's like to be around him for more than two days. I couldn't imagine if he was, I just keep thinking of that. Imagine, I have all this extra money in my account. I have, no seriously, I have like, I don't have to worry about running out of money. I'm peaceful right now. I'm not gonna have to worry about him fucking going to prison for fucking raping somebody. Like this, I don't, I don't want that life. <laughs> he can never travel with me. What kind of boyfriend, my mom would cut, like my family would cut his head off before he even got in the door for a family gathering. I had a family member like, I know a guy, you want me to, <laughs> like I swear, this guy, there's no future. Done. And you want me to be mad and jealous? Okay. Oh. Okay, what are we gonna make today? Um, we're gonna make a hell of fresh meal. We're gonna make chicken. Maybe I should just feed a whole bunch of sausage again. <laughs> I'd make him Hitman arc. Hitman arc. No, not gonna kill him. But. Do you hear this shit? Do you hear this shit? I cannot stand the dude, but do you hear this shit? Her chat is gonna end up getting her. This just said Hitman arc. Hitman arc. Right, Sierra? She, dude, somebody you kept driving yourself back there Chantal don't compare yourself to women and children that have been married have conjoined bank accounts live with the husband you kept driving your shit back there oh her chat is dude they're they're birds of a feather look at the look on her face dude look at the look on her face you tell me yeah, terms of service too. Look at the look on her face. Look at the look right now on her face. Shady, welcome. Perfect timing. She just laughed and said, Hitman Arc. Look at that. <laughs> Not to do that. But to maybe just the... Excuse me, to what, Chantal? Now this is what's interesting about this. So get ready. Later down the video... She pulls out this stupid coyote or some kind of spray and is like acting like she so you 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 tell me that you're talking about doing stuff to him, but then in the same sense, oh guys, I've got this. How do I use the spray? How the f do you think you use it? You get the damn nozzle and you push it. She's like, how do I use this? I don't know. Turn it upside down. Shake it around. Throw it. Throw it. Throw it at him. You just take it and you throw it. How the hell do you think you use it? Dude, you, you wonder why you, you can't tell, like, again, I cannot stand you, but you're literally sitting here trying to jeopardize your channel and sitting here, hit me in there. <laughs> Okay, let's make a fucking awesome coffee and breakfast. And subscribers are going back up. Dude, my channel does amazing. Okay, I was delusional. I don't know if this was delusion, but do you remember when we went to Toronto? Like, we didn't fight a single time. But even then, I think he was making sense to me up with somebody. Hi, Delia! Guys, heads up. I notice here in a minute it starts to get choppy. So just a heads up. It gets choppy. I'm thinking of having like maybe modding. I don't know. Holy Trinity or something just to go through my comments sometimes. Or I should put a post out. Like does anyone want like the actual task of maybe um. Wait. Wait a minute. 
Did she just say Monty go through... Wait a minute. Did, did she just say Monty? Am I... Do I need to get... Did she just say Monty or somebody go through her comment section? What? You were just talking about this man's passing mother the other day. Wait a minute, y'all. We we gotta hold on, y'all. Did she d hold on? Did I hear that correct? I'm thinking of having like maybe modding. I don't know. Oh, modding. My, my bad. She said modding. Sorry, y'all. Modding. I apologize. Modding. Yeah, she said modding. My bad. Or I should put a post up. Like, does anyone want so, like the actual task of maybe um, talking about them to get my visa? No, because actually talking about them makes people roll their eyes. And they fucking hate it. So, no. I mean, right now, 1800, yeah, because people want to react to me. You know, want to know what I'm, how I'm going to react about um, the whole situation. And I guess I'm just acting organically. Organically. It seemed like it's almost comical the, the necklace with the heart around it. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. I didn't hear the leaked audio. I honestly don't want, I don't think I want to trigger myself. Which person had her kid calling him dad? Ew! No, they didn't. Oh, no, ladies, please don't do that. Wait a minute. Okay, so there's another lie. We just heard her talk about the leaked audio with the community post. Chantal, you talked about the leaked audio in a community post. I'm telling you, Tizzy, I'm thinking that our next stream might be here in a little bit. I might need a cat nap after this, too. Oh, sorry, I get it. Yeah, I might need a cat nap after this too. Do better than that. You know what? It's not. You know what? It's not her fault. He manipulated. I'm sure he manipulated Jennifer. He manipulated. Je he manipulated every woman that reached out to him, guaranteed. So I'm not mad at women, like at all. Like this is this is really bad. You just keep their kids' names out your mouth. You fucking disgusting idiot. No, seriously, for him to name to use that as a weapon against them is gross and dangerous. Like, he could afford a necklace. He can't even afford. Did you buy that necklace yourself, Debbie? So, why don't you keep Sarah Jane's family at your mouth, eh? You did, didn't you? Like, I bought my Jafar ring. Mm hmm I'm not listening to the audio at all. I don't know, maybe someday, but... Like, when he's in the jail? Yeah. When he's in jail, I will. If, it, if he doesn't go for this for this reason, the fact that he doesn't see a problem with his behavior means it's going to happen again. So, he's going to end up in... in, in Fly by night, just by night. Fly by night, good by my dear. Hi. Sam. Fly by night, good by my dear. Rush and clean my house. Actually, my house is pretty clean. No, the boxes. Change my life forever. So I'm gonna make. I wanna be the only one. Why the other day he tried calling me on Instagram. Oh. Okay, let's talk to Beauty Beauty about uh let's see how much money she makes. Okay, knock it off, dude. You were just I, I love how she forgets the stuff she says. Dude, you were just asking Roman to go swimming the other day and get in his pool. So knock it off. You were just talking about wanting to go swimming at Roman, so cut the shit. And get the shorts out of your butt crack. Dude, you literally were just like, I oh, I want to go swim in a Roman's pool. Kelly, I'm so, it, it's, it's, sh she can't keep up with her own stories, dude. Right, Scottish? Mm -hmm. What? Oh, I just noticed the old chair is back. The chair is back, y'all. Oh, Jesus. 
I told y'all, Old Faithful will be back. Look, the old chair's back, y'all. Look at the cat hair hanging off of it. Look at that. Mm-mm-mm. Right, Okie Doe? She's like, well, I, I don't know. I could talk to Roman. Chantal, you, you can't even... What's up, bread? Oh, yeah. Bacon, bread, butter, strawberries, hummus toast. No, I'll have hummus toast with strawberries and bacon and coffee. Roman reminds you of a girl you used to date? Oh. He just said they're... <laughs> Yeah, he has to claim her because people were like, you should claim her. And, oh, no, 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 because they have no choice now. They admitted, like, it was outed that they were sleeping together the whole time. dee has been exposed. You've been exposed. Oh, oh my gosh, y'all. What a shock. What a shock, y'all. Who thought Natter and Dee Dee were sleeping together? What a shock. Oh, my gosh. I am shocked. Are you guys... She's, she's another one who could probably out him on his shit, too. He's, he's messed with the wrong women. Katie's hair is... And she didn't even fix it. Just as... Oh, he's my man. And she's she's been with, like, similar matters, like, in the past. So there's no hope. She's going to have his back the whole time. He's finally found the perfect one. That's... Yeah, so, Dee, Dee if that makes you a better woman than me, you are. You are. Because you can put up with his abusive shit. Mm-hmm. It's she's not your back. problem. <laughs> It's not funny, but somebody left that comment. And Cindy, welcome love. Like Dude, right? She is so bothered. Natter nor Dee Dee are your problem. Right? They're, oh my gosh, you guys. They're, they're, they're sleeping together. Oh my God. Holy shit. Who would have thought? Hi. <laughs> Princess PBJ. Yeah. Just put her on the counter while you're eating. Alright, Jim Ark, I'm planning this today. At Jim Ark. This is great, y'all. I think I want a personal trainer. All the money I'm saving on the, from the bump, I should put towards a personal trainer and marry him. Dude, you're Hi, a fuck. Dude. Why do you sexualize everybody? Why do you... I should get a personal trainer and marry him. Dude, you are like a creepy ass man. Gloating, welcome. Actually, I'm going to say male or female because there's female predators. Why do you just sexualize everybody? Do you think that shit is normal? I should get a personal trainer and marry him. Uh, what if he don't want to marry you? He's just doing his job. Or her job. Our girl, I'm see she dude, it's like she does, AF. She does. She confuses adult activities with love. Dude, if this were a man on YouTube, like literally like, yeah, I'm gonna get a personal trainer and I'm gonna people would be outraged, dude. My sept, welcome. People would be outraged. Exactly, Peach Girl. Why? Now you're going to be telling the cat to get off the counter. Get out the way I'm eating. Yeah. Why are you putting the cat up there? Two, two minutes from now, you're... Get down, BBJ. Get down, Sam. I'm eating. I, I'm like... Carletta. Oh, she is totally. I, I, shit, she's about to make me take a cat nap, but she's going to probably eat. She's put up a million community tabs we just read, and now she's stewed. Obviously, we've seen all the community tabs. She raged on here, talked about this literally for three and a half, four hours almost. And, yeah, she's going to get up and... Yeah, this this today is nonstop. We might have to get our cat naps in and come back. Actually, let's get BBJ a monolith. You want a monolith? You deserve a monolith. 
Yeah, it's because of the two. Yes. What? I'm saving money on my bum for not supporting a bum. I can get you a monolith. <laughs> Dude, you're a f I cannot. I cannot. Let me stop. Will you quit with the fucking dead pet jokes? Dude, I cannot stand her at this point. Piggy, welcome, love. Will you stop with the pet jokes? Dead, dude, it's not funny. Dude, are you waiting on this cat to pass? Damn, Beverly, right? Sean, let me stop. Dude, I'm so... Oh, my God, will you knock it off with the pet jokes? Yeah, Terry, I heard her say, you're not even going to... Uh, I want to travel, but I'll wait till your worm food. <laughs> Cat air, welcome, love. Putting some cream in my coffee. Actually, the coffee one is here. All right, we're speeding up this coffee oh, part. That's coffee. I'm speeding this up, y'all. Yep. Okay, oh, okay, hey, sweetie. Now okay. move. What I say. My life ever become so desperate and boring that I would let someone like Natter squat in my place and date him and take me behind the <laughs> kidding the old yell. Honestly, guys, I don't. It is clean. My mom got me this. We've seen it 50 oh, times. I'm treating my mom. My mom and I don't really have time alone together. We usually, my sister, let's see my sister. I miss my sister. Or, you know, my stepdad. So I think it would be good. We're going to treat her for dinner and then we're going to go. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. Excuse me. We're going to go hang out in the end Montreal. And, uh, this mean that they are going to kiss on his live streams now? I don't know, Jay. I don't watch their live streams. So. Why does she... Do. Dude, you just... Yeah, the only thing I've seen is so... You watch his live streams. You said it the other day. You watched his live streams. You said it. Second off, why do you keep choosing Montreal? It's so strange. Katrina, Welcome. Why do you keep choosing Montreal? Why? It's so gross. You're the biggest simp. You think you have any self-respect? You have none. And you've been outed and it's beautiful. Dude, he's been outed months ago. She goes on meetings. She's a supervisor, I guess. How long before Kiwi Farms find Dee's brother and fills him in? Apparently she told me her brother they don't get along that well and that he's kind of like Pete. Like he's, you know. Wow. He thinks, she thinks that he and Pete would get together a long while. I don't know why she said that. Though. Dude, also, whenever she grabs his head to kiss him, like, this woman is significantly larger than you. Not fatter. I mean, larger. Like, it looked like she was sticking his freaking neck. Like, <laughs> just to be, not to be rude, but you look like the bitch in this relationship. Well. <laughs> we could say a lot for you, but... We already been there, done that. We been new. Um, right? And that's, yeah, thank you, Martina. Like, why do you continue to put your best friend down? Why, why do you, like, he's not been diagnosed properly. Why do you, like, the shit, the, the shit that you say, if he would look back on this shit, I would be pissed. Second off, thank you. Thank you, Tiny. What are you... You just said Dee Dee looks... In this rela First off, you all do. Montre Montreal. Montreal. Thank you. Uh, dainty. Chantal, if, if Dee Dee looks like Janice, you... Let's continue. No, nobody's looking good out of all the three of you in this whole situation. But you, you've, you've lost a couple thousand allegedly along the way. So, um, you know, hey. Yeah, you, you've spent quite a bit of money, but that's, you know, hey. Y'all gotta grab a charger right quick.
Well, the structure is so much bigger. Mm -hmm. Well, maybe she could kick his ass. Good on her. I left one of my wigs there. She should use it. You might need it back, bud. Because it looks so small in her face. What PDA? She's the size of an amateur wrestler. And as I don't really come over. Wow. <laughs> I'm going to hell for laughing. <laughs> it's even shaped like a helmet. You know how those helmets in the old days have that? Dom Dini. Oh my god, her new name is Dom Dini. Please, please. Now that they're in a relationship, there's so many jokes we can make. I love it. Meet me. Stop it. I mean, mine are chubby ass, but. She definitely possesses a meaty jawline. No, it's the haircut is so bad. Why aren't we making more fun of the haircut? It's horrifying. It looks like a Lego figure. <laughs> is the haircut part of the Dom sub dynamic? Does she not get jealous when Mother sleeps with others? She will take any, any treatment he gives her. Matters panic face. <laughs> Remember whenever I called him on live stream the other day and he went into the room to answer it to see if I was gonna say something nice? And I started freaking out. His face was <laughs> my grandma kissed me with more passion than them. Ew! I, ew, they have no passion. It's so fake. <laughs> Imagine Didi with a whip in one hand and then you yelling in the other. Matter. James's haircut is just yeah, but I warned him. I'm gonna give you a bad haircut. I wasn't out there going, I'm gonna I can get a haircut. No, you can't get a haircut. I raided her fridge. She's so full of shit. I never even ate a single fucking thing that he didn't. He was the one making. She ate way more than me. She's so full of crap and she kept shitting all night. Gross. Whatever. Is she supposed. Is she. <laughs> I raided her fridge. She eats the most boring shit. Why would I raid her fridge? She eats turkey. She's a turkey. Deli turkey and eggs person. That's all she eats. Why do you uh, care what she eats? I opened her fridge without asking. I, oh, I got a drink. <laughs> Is she seriously salty about that? Sorry. I'm sorry for going in your fridge when I was thirsty. He joked she was stealing his super chats when one after another came for her hair and nails. He doesn't, he, that's why, oh my God, he kept the money and did her, he won't even let her go to the salon. He, he therapy for myself or nothing. Oh my God, dude, you don't want to do therapy. I got to skip this part. Okay, let's go. We're going to skip to where... She has some frozen bacon and can't figure it out. She's, I'm, let me teach you how to make Baker Mikey Rafe bacon. So, let's skip. I'm sick of hearing the same shit over and over. So, she gets this bacon out, okay? She gets this bacon out and she's going to teach us how to make microwave bacon. Okay, so, but this is the part that I want you guys to hear. Yeah. Imagine all that cholesterol, she says. Man, I put my bacon in the oven. Y'all, put the bacon on the oven with a piece of foil and then put it out on a paper towel. Bingo, bango. Okay. This is the part that I want y'all to hear. That, now, okay, remember we just did all that raging about Dee Dee. She's this, she's that. Now listen, this is her sincere side coming out. Oh, Dee Dee, I just wish you would leave him. I wish you would leave him. Uh, Grandma's good. We went to the farmer's market today. KK's Corner, welcome. Welcome. Mama to Kitties, welcome. Jess, welcome. All right, y'all, get ready. This is where, now we went from all that to, now, Dee Dee, I just want you to leave him. I, I, I just want you to leave him. Now, look, here. here's our little empath here. Going to teach us how to make microwave bacon. Here we go. Y'all, get ready. Th this is great. This is great. But, I'm in love with bacon now. She's in love with bacon, y'all. Mmm, bacon. I've been craving French onion soup. Had am, Art. Yep. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love how bacon's had on, but not getting women. That makes a lot of sense. Sorry, it's different reasoning, I know. But, just making, like, bitter. Are you kidding? It's still frozen. Who would have thought? Frozen bacon is hard to disassemble too. This is great, y'all. Okay, Maybe you could have ran the pack under some water. I don't know, Chantal. 
Maybe, maybe run it under. She left it in the thing. Harem, better than harem, yeah. I guess you're a pickle. Come on. Let's have bacon hands. Come on, Eric. Pork every day. Pork products, Eric. <laughs> I cannot believe they released that audio. Woohoo! I love you guys. Whoever did that. You guys are awesome. Ah, you're a liar. Another one knows. Everyone knows. Everyone's been known. How gross you are. Everyone's been known. What's happening to bacon under arms? Did she just oh, take that? Did she just scratch that knife with her back? Yeah, it's the package is open now. <laughs> Lydia <Lady> Jane! <laughs> Oh, I see what you mean. Aha. Thank you. Well, the bacon will be less salty now. Uh, because of this? The bacon will be less sodium because she's running it underwater. The bacon will be less salty. Interesting, Chantal. Interesting. <laughs> Oh my gosh, y'all, this is great. The bacon will be less sody. I scratched my back with a knife, yes. I know, I suck. I know, bacon juice everywhere. Look. Just because you come out of a wine doesn't mean that I'm not a train wreck. I'm still a train wreck. This is not going to change. Oh, we know. <laughs> they don't know. That's the problem. Such a clue in your mouth. Ready, y'all. This is the part coming up. It's too much bacon. Kind of is. Ew. Just got bacon water. Look at the beach. Y'all, I'm about to speed this up so we can get to the part. Thing is, he would probably try to get make me jealous or mad at something that's not going to do, so he can still protect his wives and still not claim her. So that's for you, Didi. Uh, but Blanky, he doesn't welcome he love. Up to her because he paid. She paid. It's really a sad predicament you're in, and I'm really not jealous. Uh oh, that's sad. Okay, here we go, y'all. Here we go. That's sad, sad arrangement they got. And I'll be putting her life in shambles in this bag. Aww. See, it would be okay. If you deserve vindication, you don't deserve to be proud, and you're in the wrong. What is? So you don't deserve vindication. The sooner you realize what is that, that? Whoa, well, wait a minute. The easier it will be on you. But you'll never know because you're in the wrong. Whoa, so. whoa. What's on her stomach? What is on her stomach, y'all? Hold on a sec. What is that? Hold on, y'all. Let me slow it down. Oh God, she's got a live scheduled. Here, well, let's keep going for. Hold on. What is that, y'all? Anybody notice? Yeah, is it Chrissy and welcome? Hold on, y'all. Be okay if you deserve vindication, but is... you don't realize that you're just a piece of crap and you're in the wrong. So you don't deserve vindication. What is that, y'all? It's definitely Miss T. Welcome, send welcome. It no, it's not a mole. It was up here. It keeps moving. Hold on, y'all. Let's put this at regular. Speed. What the hell is that? No, it because it, it was up here and then it. Do you realize that about yourself? <gasps> is that a? Wait a minute, y'all. That just hold on. 
Sorry, we gotta go back. Hold on, y'all. Is that a, um... And I'll be putting her life in shampoos in this bag. Okay, first off, anybody else see what I... I didn't notice is there's a, a rip in the sports brawl. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. We'll get to the live. Jackie, welcome. Hold on, y'all. I'm trying to... Uh, see, it would be okay if you deserved vindication. But Sorry, you I'm trying to get the right... Piece of crap and you're in the wrong. So wow, you know, the... Does she not feel that? It's not a chocolate chip, my friends. It's some kind of bug, but I'm trying to see, is it a Pacific kind of bug? Vindication. The sooner you... Uh, that's definitely some kind of... Hold on, yo. Realize that about yourself? Damn it, yo, I'm trying the to... easier it will be on you. But you never will, because you're in America, so... Damn it. What is that? Hold on, y'all. More coffee. <laughs> I apologize, y'all. It's... That's what I'm looking at, Tweet, but look at the... Hold on, y'all. I'm gonna put y'all... Sorry. Hold on, y'all. We'll, we'll go live. Hold on a second. y'all I know I'm trying to hold on y'all let me get when she was right cloud goblin welcome love no same it's a bug y'all it, it's it's I don't know if it's alive but it is a bug there's definitely legs yeah there's there's definitely legs If you notice, it went from the top of the sports bro down to the bottom. I'm telling you, hold on, y'all. It, it, it's not, hold on, y'all. Here we go. Hold on, and then we'll go to the live. Hold on. Actually, I have that sewing kit number from what's it called there? Damn it, man. <laughs> Damn it, y'all. She won't stay still long enough. Because it was, it was up here. And now, hold on, y'all. My one face. Motel. So I don't know, y'all. <laughs> yeah. The easier it would be on you. But you never will because you're in America. So. It's definitely got legs. All right, y'all. Let's move on. I can't get to the right um, dynamic to uh, 
All right, hold on. Let's hear this part about where she begs Dee Dee. So there's that. More coffee. <laughs> okay, toast goes in. Just put the hole in my bra. They're talking about a hole in her bra. How does nobody see this damn bug? No thanks. Actually, how about someone kid number? From what's it called there? No one face. How the hell, whatever it is, she, yeah. Does she not feel that shit? Hotel? I don't know what it does. It's fucking funny. Oh, your shit. Right Right Okay, yeah. Go eat chicken soup. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Fat boy. Look at this fat boy. You're fat. Everyone knows. Keep your toes out of here, you fatty fat. The pawn shop? I don't know. We didn't make a pawn shop. Like, he wanted one. He asked me, and I thought he was joking. Um, he hates women so much because he has no one to blame himself. You think women are just going to take it? Like, what, were you raised on me or something? He projects his closetness on women. Ugh. Would I get a hotel? No, I'm insulting you as that. Absolutely not. I was supposed to get an apartment for us, and I did. <laughs> so, no. Okay, y'all. Let's watch quickly. It's too big to be a tick, it looks like, I think. Um, all right, y'all. Let's hear this part about Dee Dee wanting or her wanting him to leave or Dee. Her wanting Natter to. Dee Dee to leave Natter, and then we'll switch to live. You gotta wait, see the way she says this. I do anything for him. Oh, that nature. Ever. Hey, she just itched. Did you see her scratch? What's there to miss? Like I keep saying, like there's nothing to miss. <laughs> Where'd the damn thing go? Oh, no. But she can't be supporting him. Like she told me that she thinks he's trying to get money out of me to pay Diddy back. Oh, over six hundred. I think she had to borrow money from her brother. It's so coming up, y'all. Pay your new girlfriend. Fuck you. It's coming up, y'all. Oh, shit. Well, what am I toes? No, oh, nothing, so. That's a sign. He keeps answering my phone calls. Did you hear it? 
He keeps answer. He answered my phone calls at the hotel. But he keeps answering my phone calls. Did y'all catch that? Listen. That explains too. He kept answering my calls at the hotel. He keeps answering my phone calls, but he cannot see me. He couldn't see me because of Dee. You catch it? There it was. He keeps answering my phone calls. So she still keeps calling him. Oh, Tizzy, I think it's somewhere. The bug is somewhere. You catch that? Por oranges, oranges, welcome. Uh, I don't know. There was a spot on her back. We seen Mandy, welcome. You catch that, y'all? So there it was. He keeps answering, so she keeps calling. But she's done with them, y'all. Okay, we're going to watch this quick part about talking about Dee Dee, and then we'll move on. He's been secretly telling her they're in a relationship the whole time. And then, of course, she had to kick him out because he was getting together with me in an apartment with me. They were fighting behind the scenes. And, oh my God. Anyway. I'm just putting things in my head now. I know, like, you know what I mean? But it does help knowing hear it from her mouth, but I didn't hear it. It does I'm help, y'all. Yeah. actually hear it from her mouth. But. Anyways, you're insane. <laughs> Alright, so I need Jesus, how long does it take you to make a damn cheese tomato sandwich and bacon? Good night. Yo, I apologize her uh internet's choppy today. Hey, did you see her itch again? She itched again. Make out to celebrate their yeah, <gasps> dude. Your punishment having to kiss each other. Get ready, y'all. Oh, here comes. <clears throat> he really thinks I'm jealous of me. That's funny. <laughs> Try harder. We'll find a hooker. If you want to make me jealous, I don't know. I'm not gonna be. I can't be jealous anymore because I, I feel so much better about him. <laughs> mm. Okay. I don't want to put you through the eating, but this is the part coming up that we need to hear. Watch her mannerisms, and listen to the tone of her voice. Jennifer, welcome. When she says, Dee Dee, please leave him. Please leave him, Dee Dee. You tell me what y'all think about this coming up. And I apologize. I hate to you put y'all through the eating, but this is where the part's at. <laughs> Oh she my god, the eating just pisses mm -hmm. me off. Yes, Dee, I'm so jealous of you. And your crappy C.H. Robinson job and your new speaker boyfriend. They can touch you and look at a very important piece of information, Dee. Traveling the world or being bogged down by a narcissist. I'll take traveling the world, thanks. Gotta do oh. it, Chantal. Mmm. Nikki Collins. Welcome to a very important piece of information, Dee. Travel in the world, y'all. <laughs> Travel in the world. Can you find the email on LinkedIn? Yeah. You're trying to make me jealous? Come a little too late. We're going to Britain, Ireland? I hope we can do that now, but then have her question. She has no self worth. I mean, she has no self worth, guys. She has no self worth. Now they're never going to the hotel is a blessing. <laughs> Hi, thinking tattooed. Mm, what's that song? Mm, now, Gigi. Now that lose you to love me has so much meaning. You know why? Here's why. You won him and lost your reputation, dignity, and credibility. Bravo. We could say the same for you. And I wouldn't talk about itty bitty boo exactly. We're getting a lot of that where you're going, buddy. <laughs> I bet you everything he told me about that too. Live, live. Never the prison boss. Dude, can any does anybody think here that Natter was a prison boss? Oh my gosh, Nashville. They've been everywhere. Chantal, I don't I think this guy might have had you fold, but I don't think he had any of us fold. Sen, welcome. Chantal. Your quote-unquote life experiences 
I see the chat here, and I... Not looking like anybody was fooled. Len, welcome, love. All right, y'all. As soon as we hear this part, we'll move on from this. Listen, though, y'all. Get ready. This part is creepy. Creepy, y'all. Get ready. Oh. She's disgusting. She's disgusting. Right? He, he was the prison threader. <laughs> Please. I know. <laughs> oh, Scobie, see the way he dances. Like he's a prison boss. Imagine having your entire co workers, your boyfriend, went to prison. But like he was kidnapped, guys. Which one is it? You're a real man who allowed yourself to be kidnapped? Because you're not a real man if you allowed yourself to be kidnapped. Isn't that right, Matter? Which one is it? <laughs> what did you say? He doesn't realize he shoots himself in, the own foot, in his own foot. I didn't go live. I passed out late, early. Man, I wonder what's coming August 3rd for sure. I'll be watching it from the comfort of my home. Oh, this is this is when... Yo, here we go. Get ready. This is everything I told you on the beat. Get ready. This one, she says, Monty needs to be careful. This is great. Nobody... Mary, welcome. Dude, nobody is scared of Natter. Chantal, nobody thinks that he's a prison boss like here we go hold on y'all here here we go get ready this is great y'all she says Monty you better you better be careful Monty dude the way she eats I just it, it uh, did you think she's Tori spelling on the death of the teacher leader and Chantal is the killer I don't think I'm gonna go nuts now and stop them. Like I really like listen to her chat. Listen to her chat. They are literally comparing Chantal to a movie as Chantal killer character. This this new group of people is as bat she's naive crazy as she is. Oh lovely. My family would be like go eat by yourself and you're we're never taking you to a restaurant. Slow it down a bit. Yeah, hold on. Okay, this is the part. They're like literally comparing her to a... Chantal, you've got quite the new duo dynamic. Okay, this is a regular speed. Because this is what I've been waiting now to hear. Yeah, the KOC family uh, is uh, part of the Pondus. Because uh, they are... Yeah, I'm going to... I got it on normal speed. Because this is what I wanted y'all to hear. So we'll, we're hitting now at normal. He really still thinks I want him. That's fucking funny. Y'all, get get ready. This is, like, interesting. Mm, I'll watch it on Monty's if he covers it. Sure. Be careful, Monty. I'm fucking warning you. This guy is nuts. You might think, I'm not afraid. No. <laughs> Bring some... He's... <laughs> She's advising Monty to take something to the courthouse. Chanto, I, I say next time you go to the courthouse, you should probably take something and see how that works out. Y'all, get ready. This part coming up. Look at this. Donna, Donna, Donna. Get get ready, though. When she says this DD part, this shit is creepy as all hell. She's like, please, DD. Please, please. Oh, I think that they are serious over there with that KOC shit. I, I think they're y'all get ready. This is this is great. Chantal, you didn't take a big enough bite, buddy. He'll need someone to put money on his books. You will be there. Maybe we'll do it and not even get the green pean. Mm -hmm. You will be there. Mm-hmm, absolutely. I don't even believe they're in a relationship. I believe the one to be like a hurt you, another child. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They're not in a relationship, but he's fuck they're fucking. <laughs> 
they're waiting for me to show up with the boxing gloves. Hey, D2, let's fight for the game. No, thanks. Mm-hmm. Anyway. Anyways. I want to go visit my grandpa in Florida and go to Disneyland. I would love to see Chantal y'all walk through Disneyland. I would love to see it. I would love to see it. I would Chantal, I think that you should totally go walk through Disneyland. Go walk through Disneyland, please do. Mm, that bacon is good. Good breakfast. I want some strawberries. She murked that. Oh, wait a bit. Oh, YouTube rejects life. She, to get, I would love to see her. Oh, y'all, even if they have scooters, have y'all seen the strollers and the, like, D D Kim, you read my mind. The line just to get in there will be exciting. Roland, welcome, love. Okay, y'all, get ready. This is the creepiest, sketchiest. Y'all, this shit, this, this, her trying to convince Dee Dee to leave Natter is like some shit out of a movie. Universal. What about for, for, uh, Halloween? I'm going to be doing East Coast probably, but. Yes, I go Halloween. Please. I a few months to like save up and get ahead. I thought you were like, rolling in money, Chantal. We deserve it. Hummus, bacon, strawberry special. Remember the strawberry muffins I had last night? Yeah, you ate them. I was unhinged. I'm glad I did it. You know what? He went live doing all that and I was passed out sleeping. Instead of spending a romantic Friday with your man and each other, you're trying to trigger me and make me jealous. Like, that couldn't be me. He was barely ever live when we were together because, no, sorry. Uh-uh. Somebody queeps. Thank you for finally seeing the light. Queen, now do the right thing by unblocking Shandong. <laughs> Blocking them is unjust. <laughs> Are you shit rabies? I gotta worry about that after, yeah, about all the unblocking. Grandma Judy and Gat and all that. Their shorts wedged up my ass. No, I wasn't in barbecues live yesterday. Mm -mm. That was a fake me. Months in advance. I know. My friend was telling me that, yes, it's horrifying, Kristen. <laughs> I know. But if I visit my grandfather, he lives in Florida, then I will definitely do something. Why haven't you blocked Dee Dee? I did. I think I blocked her. She's never in here to block her. So she should, I'm pretty sure I blocked her. She's still a member. Hopefully no one gets hurt before he goes to jail. Hope not either. I need to get a freaking weapon. Honestly, just a um, like a, a pistol or a handgun, not an assault weapon. But no, I. She needs to get a, but not an ass. Shanto, buddy has never showed up at your house. You continue to drive there. Guys, I'm going to speed it up so we can get to this part.
Chantal, the last thing you need is a firearm. You have to... Oh, my God. He, I, I... He's never been to your house unless you've brung him there. Exactly, Chantal. I thought you were against apparatuses. I didn't even get one because of my mental health. They wouldn't even give me one. They do suck the bells here. Last night she said she will still be a beezer and that she always will because she sees what you say. She, they, did, they have no case. After everything they've said, they did both matter on me swear up and down you didn't bring them back to Montreal. After you did give them a but yes, this is them lying after everything I do and stressing out for them. She lied too with them. They're oh, all the three. Me, realizing it's never going to change. Hold on, y'all. Dude, they're all three liars. Yeah, hold on. It's too fast. My bad. They're all three liars, dude. She's like, they lied. So did you. I don't know what these people are like. Sh oh my gosh, y'all. Right, mom and the kitties. Okay, first off. Ah, yay, yay. Chantal, you lied right along with them, dude. Knock it off. No, I could never I could never have a gun here, yeah. You but don't need a gun. What I do have is this. Watch out, y'all. She's scary. She didn't even have to work it. All right, so all I have to do is move it over like that. Domestic dog and coyote attack deterrent. So I'm going to put this irritant. So if I just push it over like that, I can spray it. So I'm going to keep it near my bed. And if anyone comes to fuck with us, they're getting it right in the face. Oh, you're so scary. Go ahead, Sam. Go ahead, Sam. Big and bad Chantal, y'all. I don't know what it tastes like. It's an irritant, it says. I think it's pepper spray. Or mace. I got it on Amazon. It's like bear spray. It's like dog coyote spray. It's bear spray, kind of, yeah. It's not bear spray. <laughs> what if I spray pizza the night? Wasp spray is like pepper spray? Oh. Right, Mandy? She's so big and bad. Hammer. Yes. Damsel in defense. Okay. JB, damsel in defense. Yes. And I'm making t merch, too, this weekend. I'm going to roll it out next week. It's, it's going to say, thank you, Dee Dee. <laughs> Why? I'm so curious about what story he spun about stabbing. Oh, my God. I can tell you guys all about that later. Too. He basically said, like... So, so here you go. <laughs> Let me tell you now, and then I'll tell you again later. Yo, get ready. So, she's going to tell him later, but she's going to tell him now. Right, Hans? She is... Okay, so let's tell you now, and then she'll. She, we're not going to listen later, so just tell us now. Right, Kim? He basically said that she asked him to come over. They were broken up. She had a no contact order on him, too. Oh, maybe she didn't follow it like you. Dog deterrent should keep Nava away. Or she <laughs> followed it unlike you, my bad. Oh, uh, Canada is illegal under the phone. Yeah, it's very hard. It's harder to get. Crafting, welcome, love. Yeah, Chantal is so gangster, y'all. She is triple OG, triple OG. Like, if you want to hunt, you can get a rifle. He called me Delphine number two because he... No, 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 no. He called me Delphine number two because I was going to put him in jail just like Delphine did. Bitch, you put yourself in jail. You stabbed her. You put yourself in jail. So, you hit me. You put yourself in jail. I thought he didn't hit you. Last week you I told said you I don't he want anal. You kept pushing. You put yourself in jail. Anyway. <laughs> Piece of shit assholes. I fucking hate you and I hope you burn in hell and I hope you go to jail. Alright. Sorry. So he told me that she called him over and uh, I don't remember exact details, but she called him over. He called called him over. He went over. He she lured him over there or whatever, I don't know. I don't know how he got there. Anyway, he ended up in a room with not this big. He said this is his big native. Her big native cousin was blocking the doorway, and he couldn't move. She was holding him back, so he couldn't move. So he. So then, if she's holding your arms, how did you stab her? Like, where did you have the time to go into the fucking kitchen and get a knife? So I just kind of like, you know, 
She lured him over with her fupa. Stop. I don't buy it either. And with this whole, this big native cousin who he stabbed to was not in the picture. Like in the trial, nothing. This big native cousin is nowhere to be found. <clears throat> so that's what he meant about him being kidnapped. Yes. So which is it? Because you're saying a real man would never let that happen to him. He changes it to fit his narrative. Classic narc move. Yes. Safe to say he lied about that. Same as you, buddy. Same as you. You literally, Chantal, you you literally change this to fit your narrative as well. Exactly, Martina. There there was no red flags, none of this. And now now she's cousin was a man. He's a narcissist, right? Exactly. End of story. Not said. He's a narc. Exactly, Hans. Why does it have to be native? Here we go again. Characterizing people from where they're from, their ethnicity. Sorry, y'all. Her internet gets crazy here in a minute. He wanted me. He told. And he told me the story. He told. Oh no, look at these bears. Oh my god. He told me the story on the like the second day, as if to tell me like, okay, well, I have a problem. I'm going through. Mhm. Mm He's basically saying he can't overpower. Uh, uh -oh. Okay, so. It just, here we go again. It's going to be another day of eating. Dude, again, I mean, thank you, DG. Yes, thumbs up, guys. Make sure you're subscribed. Thank you, DG. So, dude, you just ate breakfast. Granted, she has eaten strawberries, but she slathered them in sugar. They were talking bad recently about me. I'm sure they were. I, I, Frenette, welcome. Yeah, I'm sure they were. I'm sure I missed that along the 350 streams of the same things. Gee, welcome, love. Narcissist, absolutely. People look up more about... My mom says people look up more about buying a car than who they sleep with. You're right, Vegas. She's right, Vegas, doll. Well, this has taught me, too. So the whole truth came out. Just watch the combo. I feel for you, Chantal. Thank you, Holly. Thank you. I don't know why your words made me emotional, but yes. It did give me some closure. Yeah. Yeah, it did. Because for some reason, even though I knew, I had to know. You know what I mean? Because <laughs> they were driving me nuts. You should look up a story that happened in the U.S. about a state that had a trailer. Yes, the toy box killer. Oh, fuck. Have you considered apologizing for lying, for defending a woman? I haven't even, like, begun to think of all the apologies I need to do. Mandy, thank you, love. Okay, y'all, this is the part in the beginning, if you've been here, that I was telling you about where she's like, Lisa, ooh, Lisa coming in with heat. Natter told Dee Dee last night that Chantal weighs over 400 pound, pounds but doesn't want people to know. Well, I think it's clear. Thank you, Lisa. Yeah, I, I think we all pretty much, especially with the uh, garment she's been wearing or not wearing lately. Okay, so here we go. But, did I handle it? I don't think women should apologize for how they handle it because you don't, like, when you're in it, you're so fucked up. It's just crazy. I don't know how to explain it. But it is possible. Mace is illegal, I think, if you use it on a person, but I'm going to use it on a person. If you come in here, it's either that or you get shot. So Mace is better than you can invade him. It's either you come in there or you get... What What are you shooting them with? Does Pete's have a water gun? A little pony might... <coughs> what What are you shooting them with? A strawberry in the eye? What What are we doing here? You're, you're, you're getting a little big for your britches. You're, you're getting, well, never mind. What, what are we doing here? 
Look at her. She, yo, she is, look, she is serious, yo. Shanto, you do not scare anybody. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to go on self-defense mode. Everyone does. Everybody does, yeah. For a sweet heat. Oh, my God. How did Dee and him really meet? I have no idea. Yeah, I have to heal first, Amanda. I'm serious. Self-defense is okay. The fupa is a weapon. How are you going to shoot them exactly? I have no gun. I'll, so my mace is all I have. Uh. Yeah. So I'm confused. So are you, I, I thought you were just, so we're not going to pop, uh, we're not going to pop a cap in somebody's ass. Wait a minute. After the audio, I really could see how messed up her head was. You're blind when you're with an arc. I was till he broke my jaw. I'm sorry you went through that. Fucking sick. <laughs> a low empath, y'all. The only apology you need to make is to yourself. Only climate and love for you now. Thank you, Mikey. Yes. Chantel Soro is worthy. Just release your stank. I actually do wash my fupa very well. Thank you very much. Nowadays. <laughs> you gotta keep, keep very clean, yeah. You gotta keep clean, guys. That is everything. No bugs climbing on you. Let's go smoke a dupe. Or no, I'm not going to smoke a dupe till tonight. Yeah. Sorry, guys. It gets, it gets wonky here. So, just heads up for you guys in the replay. This was on her end when I was watching it to get these parts for us. Other day for the fupa. Who's suddenly distracted and broken? Eating? We all know. Uh, he's freaking. She was traumatized, so was I. We probably both. He. It makes sense to me now. He was also. It never occurred to me he's lying to her too. He was lying to her too, guys. Saying. Chilean, welcome, love. Chilean, I checked my emails and didn't see anything. I did check them. Okay, y'all. Here we go. Get ready, y'all. This is the part that is like a scary-ass movie. So she talks all this shit about Dee Dee. Now, check this part coming up. He was her crazy ass. I'm sure he was lying to her to say whatever he needed to to use her in her condo. He drinks her wine, smokes her... He's fucking invading her life. I do feel a bit bad for her. Okay, here we go, y'all. Get ready. <laughs> yeah, they traumatizing threesome. Hold on, I need to smoke. <laughs> Fucking stress out. Oh. And then... Down under! You're big, beautiful beaver. I have believed you from the beginning. Thank you! That's a general. Thank you so much. You guys are so sweet. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, November. <laughs> But yes. When she thought he was coming. Yeah. Oh my gosh, Okie Doll. Okie Doll says she's greened out already on her life. All right, let's listen to this part. This is what we've been waiting for right here, and we'll check it out. I remember how I do, like I hate when she placates him and giggles <laughs> nervously because if you don't placate him, he gets nasty. But you draw back there, bud. I would do a tell all, fucking with beauty. If you want to expose him, let me know. Oh my god, dude, Take you've already told everything. A with a jog. Dee Dee, do it. Everyone will fall. Everyone will fall her right. I'm away from him. She doesn't see it. She doesn't see it. I mean, come on. The hell, Dee Dee, get a man that puts you first. Absolutely. Vegas, I've been blocking. Y'all get home. ready. This is scary. Uh, she loves Moroccan men. She loves Moroccan men. <clears throat> Right now, she's probably too much in love with Natter. I get it, because I was. She said she 
she'll be by his side forever. That's really sad. Internal peace, they can tattoo it. It feels so good. Like, anyone who doesn't know what it's like to leave <coughs> a narc abusive relationship is BBY, like... welcome y'all. I love how she goes and scratches her... Remember the other day we were talking about how she scratches her her fingers with her teeth? I love it. Come on, Chantal. Give us this scary movie footage. Come on. Number one, it's extremely fucking hard to leave. So if you made it out, <sighs> maybe she's like you and needs to work. And she's an Aries. I think she's my foil I in a lot of ways. I swear to fucking God. I believe people are put in your life to teach you lessons. Absolutely. Either you're... People come into your life for good or to teach you lessons. And this was a lesson, unfortunately. Boy, this is a lesson you ain't learned yet. I did. Yeah. Yeah. Chantal is looking for a classy man that has a great job and makes money. Can you imagine taking Chantal out to dinner and be like, Chantal, your your mannerisms and manners are beautiful. Keep it up. We love it. This love it for you. They do have air conditioning, but she doesn't turn it on because she they smoke in the house, so they do the windows open. Believe me, when I was there, I was like, "Can you put the A's back?" But they kept chain smoking. It's not your house. They don't have to. So she couldn't have the windows open. And she I was didn't like, have to turn the air on for you. I'm dying, man. Then you could have went home. Your air is too, Sherry. She should hit up Roman. He has a jacuzzi. I don't know if Roman would. Probably not. Maybe. I bet it's, it smells like fucking cigarettes. Well, she has like a small condo, but she has really high ceilings, so it doesn't feel s small in there. Hey, Diego. I think she should, honestly, at this point, objectively, she should kick his fucking ass out. If she has any res respect for herself, she would kick his fucking ass out and get someone better. And do a channel exposing him. Do it. Get him the fuck out of there, man. Like, he's not worth it. His pain is not worth it. He's only there screwing you because he didn't get an apartment with me. How does that make you feel? Like, leave him. Dude, she is literally looking like she is on the verge of crying. Watch this, y'all. Watch her mannerisms and watch her eyes when she's like, Please, Didi, please get ready. Chantal, you only want Dee Dee to leave, so you, it, Martina, you said the exact word I was about to say. Swoop and scoop him right up. Get right, Leo. She literally looks, she couldn't even look into the camera when she was saying some of this. Get ready, y'all. Watch this. Isn't pissed off after all the stuff that she was saying on the audio. Beatrice, oh, welcome. Pay for that. He has to live there. He doesn't, he has to live there. He's cornered. Opposed to subjectively kicking out. I'm saying objectively, like remove your feelings for him out of it. She's besotted, not going to happen. Yeah, no. He will lash out at her off camera. I don't see it happening, Chantal. I believe she will definitely hang in there. That's really sad. To try to stick it to me? Girl, you won. Dee Dee, look at me. You won. Let's all give her a round of applause, everyone in the chat. Because I don't want what you have. At all. <laughs> At all. I can promise you that. Because if I did, I would have it. I would be in an apartment suffering right now in Montreal. She has until August 3rd. <laughs> yeah. Crew, welcome, love. Memphis, why do I think welcome. Going to jail? I'll tell you why. Because her story is a lot more believable now that the timeline matches up. Oh, now, now that the timeline matches history up. history of it. And anyone who knows the story online, you are going to be in shit. This reminds me of them claim. Anyone that knows the story online, you are going to be in some shiznai. Anyone that made a fake alibi for him, we ain't got nothing to do with this. What are you talking about? And just saying, or May went to just saying. 
So no, nobody on here is going to be in trouble. If anybody's going to get in trouble, it's going to be you that gave him the alibi. May went to just saying. May goes herself in Troll Detective's comments. You are the one that came on here with, so what are you talking about? What are you talking about, dude? So after the May stuff, his trial is coming up and he's claimed DD. Uh, <laughs> Reggie sent me these, Agathon. Yeah, how do you like that, Willa Dina? Agathon wants me. Oh, yeehaw. Oh, bitch. Okay. I hope Monty actually go, goes and streams it. He should go and live stream the whole thing so that nothing can happen to him. Because remember, that is, I hope I see you in the basement. Nobody's scared. If he has nothing to lose, he probably would try to do something to Monty. Back of my mind, I don't think he's going to jail. Evil people always seem to get away. I know. I don't know. Shut up and leave. No, I'm not deleting the live. Caroline. Where's more audio, Norma? Monty in the courtroom, Natter will freak out. I know. <laughs> He's going to ask Dudu to smuggle in a fourth pyramid CD. Stop. <laughs> I can sing that song. <laughs> Do you think he claimed Dee Dee since they knew the audio was getting leaked? Leaked? Probably, yeah. Because what are they going to say now? But, uh, but ironically, shut up and leave. He's now claiming Didi to make damage control for the lies, but he, by doing this, he's confirming he's a liar. So either way, you're a liar. Was he lying about being off probation? I have no idea. Don't forget, he was lying to me more than anyone. So for me, I have no idea. I don't know this guy at all. That's why he has a fart and the wind. No one says he's definitely going. We're going to jinx it. <laughs> I despise work. He called everyone bums when he stole shoes from Walmart. Or he wanted to. He didn't do it with me that day. I made him put them fucking back. I want you to promise us you will not fall back into his trap. I pro I cannot even believe you guys still think I will fall into his trap. Do you see? If I go back to him, he will kill me. No, no doubt. I'm his enemy. And he said many times, don't fuck with a guy who has nothing to lose. He's going to, he's on trial. Like, he has nothing. Like, no, there's no way. I have no feeling for him. Like, I have a, more feeling for the jar of olives in my fridge right now. A lot more feeling for the olives, actually. I don't think they knew Chantal. The look on Dee's face once they kept saying there's a new audio about was so cool. Fuck yeah. Please just disconnect yourself from him and her completely. He's a crappy person and it's clear to anyone. Yep. Right, Lynn? They swore on Dee Dee's mother that they aren't a couple. Does she have life insurance? <laughs> you don't want you hurt up the honest truth. Thanks, Google. And I appreciate it. I love VIEs, can we say this again for the 50th? In time probably today she drives herself back there Chantal is the one that drives over there Jiminy Christmas you guys have helped me see for sure if I didn't have a public platform I'd probably be in a fucking apartment with him was told in chat about uh, because you know what look what happened to fucking delphine oh now, zero original now it's all i know channels would get garfield or one of delphine's them they probably don't want to relive it but it's I none of our fucking business dude it's none of our business the lady is past let her rest in peace it's nobody's business. Let this poor woman rest in peace. She has a daughter that your ass mentioned. Let the lady rest in peace. God damn. Always out. That's another thing women go through when they dealt with the toxic abusive. Yes, it's, it drives you insane, like, so and people doubt you, and you know, because you do lie for your abuser, so people don't believe you. I don't you know? believe you for anything. Jennifer Sassy, welcome. I'm sure there's so much more. Oh, I can't wait. She's probably trying to get her into the relationship, too. I couldn't afford him. Yeah, neither could his ex. No, but I would be probably living a... Like his ex? 
<coughs> I'd probably be working at a really decent job. Like before I started YouTube, I had a good job. I'd probably be working. A Dude, you got shit canned. You got shit canned. They paid you to leave. You said you weren't even allowed to go back to your desk. They paid you to leave. And technically, you said it yourself. You're not even supposed to be talking about this shit on here. That is why they gave you the settlement to zip it. You yourself have said they paid you to can it. So, tell us again how you'd be working at the job that the doctor hated you, in your own words. Tell us again, Chantal. Job, middle mid mid-wage. I wouldn't be a public figure, but I would be successful. She wouldn't be a Just public like figure, like, y'all. Like, knock on wood, I like to be ambitious. I go through ruts and everything, but... She's the ambitious, y'all. We're going to fix it so you don't have to watch that. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Katie, she really thinks she'd won. He's gonna dump her when he finds a younger, miserable, vulnerable, willing idiot. Like the girl on the porch. Like, she may have been homeless, but there's no doubt he was fucking her. She was good looking, you know, and younger and can get pregnant. Oh, so, yeah, he's gonna wait a minute. Okay, first off, how do you know, unless there's something you're not telling us, that that was the pregnancy test about the girl on the porch? And I thought she wasn't cute. Wait a minute. Chanto, you, why are you talking about somebody else getting pregnant? And, dude, let me shut up, because I'm going to end up getting shit canned today. I, I'm just, I'm sick of her bullshit today. Well, all the time. Right, Peach Girl? That's why I'm like, let me be quiet before I say something on here that, uh, well, I'm not going to regret. But, Andy, welcome, love. Be careful. Yeah. I don't know what the hell was going on with whatever, but that thing did have legs, y'all. He, he wants kids. You don't think if he doesn't go to jail, he's going to give me a break. You've helped him for nothing, just like I did. He's a piece of crap. Abusive piece of crap. No, the porch lady, yes. I feel bad for her. Oh, now, wait, 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 wait. Now you feel bad for her. You were talking shit. I remember specifically ripping your ass because you were assuming that she was an addict. Re-welcome. And now you feel bad for the girl. You were making fun of her. And it seemed like she was having some kind of... You said there was condoms and a candle on the porch. And you assumed she was homeless. And you named her the fucking porch girl. And now you feel bad for her. Get out of here, dude. You make... Dude, you, you try to suit this shit to your narrative. You're not... I'm sorry, dude. Let me be quiet. If you're watching Porch Lady and you want to come on my channel and give us a tell-all, I'll give up. you a meal, I'll give you fucking 200 bucks, oh. drive you to a shelter, oh. and help you get clean. Call me. I must have been letting the door, I heard, I didn't hear that part. Where the fuck? Where do we adjust? Yeah, do we start with that part? Okay, $200. Kiss my fucking ass. We spend that in one haul half the time. So your little $200 ain't shit. And second off, get clean. Drive you to a shelter. You don't even know if this chick is homeless first off. Second off, you can't even get clean off gummies and edibles. Who in the f*** do you think you are? Can we get Yabba sewing board? You were talking about turning yourself in for some dumbass gummies. I be dazzling. I have no idea, love. Dude, just what I think she can't say anymore crazy shit. Chantal, I don't know who the hell you think you are and your self right. This public figure shit is way, way went to your head. Dude, you tweaking, man, that just added a whole nother plot of icing on the cake. Dude, you 
are fucking insufferable at this point. Excuse my language today. She has got me. Dude, you can't even not quit smoking a joint or your eating situation. Let's, I didn't even hear that earlier. I, I didn't even, Chantal, this public figure shit. I think you're confusing uh, famous with infamous. I, I think it's, it's a, man, your family really needs to take a step and look at your channel. No pressure. The poor lady. Mm -hmm. This guy is disgusting. <laughs> He's a poor lady. It's a, I think a homeless woman. And he has the nerve to be like, you think I could screw homeless? He got so mad at me and like almost freaking hit me too when I said that. He's like, you think I screw homeless? What do you think I am? Yes, I do. I and mean, I think you're a piece of crap. Look at me. I think you're a piece of crap. Well, we you. think you are as well. And you can't punch this face right now. I don't know. What dude, what the you. fuck? Is, like, why do you keep coming on here saying this shit, dude? Chantal, why do you... How the fuck do people... Like, sorry. I don't even care anymore today. Fuck it. How do you keep putting your people through this shit? This is not what the fuck... Vic yeah, I'm going to say it today. This is not what the fuck victims do. They don't go up here and be like, you can't punch me in my face. Bitch, get yourself together today because you are just like antagonizing people. That is not what victims do. That is not what people that are scared of somebody do. You need to take a real fucking step back because somebody, let me stop because I'm going way too far. Let me chill out, because I'm going to say some shit, and it ain't going to be pretty. But, you are not a victim. Fuck it. I'm going to say it. You drive your ass there. You just sat here, and you talk about... I'm sorry. Yes, I'm trying to keep it clean. I'm sorry. I'm set. Let me let me regroup here. Let, she, she just takes me to a place that is just... Dude, Chantal, you need to watch this shit and rewatch it because you are just antagonizing and I apologize, y'all. Give her seven meals, one for each day of the week. You can do it, Beezer. <laughs> no, I haven't been crying. I just woke up. I'm, I've been smoking. I'm so concerned for duty. Yeah, because like, yes. Because I see how women are manipulated by him. Oh, I'm triggered, but it, it, it started with the whole fit welcome. It started with the whole shit with the homeless lady and the 200 bucks and get clean. Chantal, I don't know who you think you are. You can't even help get your fucking self together. So I don't know what you got yourself on a pedestal of a public figure. Peppa, welcome everybody coming in. I apologize, but I don't know who the hell for real, and I'm not trying to be funny right now, that this bitch thinks she is. And dare to strike me, because I got a whole fucking list of shit that you do, Chantal. Who do you think that you are thinking that you're better than somebody else? How do you... Uh, because the girl is homeless, she's on drugs? Is that what you're assuming? So because she's homeless, she must be on drugs. Get the hell out of here. You wonder why I pee. I could give a shit if you weighed 80 fucking pounds. Your attitude stinks. Her. Like, she's given so much of herself for him. She, whatever, inserted herself, yes, but. Hmm. Thoughts on Dee's diarrhea? Maybe I actually am defending Dee because I'm actually fucking grateful for her sacrifice. She really, really, really did me a favor. Because him abusing me and hitting me wasn't enough for me to leave him. Or maybe it was. It actually started, like, the more it happened, the more he got comfortable with it and like every time I would go back it would be like a red light for a green light for him to do it so you know it would just get worse and worse and he did he did he was scary you know our selfie say cheese what 
so same way you didn't listen to any of us for over a year she's not the thing is carolina i did listen to you guys i didn't not listen i was listening even if it was passively even though i chose to ignore it a suitcase finish i still heard all of you guys and it was weighing on me that's why we get defensive and because i knew you were right Nader was so smug talking about Jennifer Corbina was going to buy a house in Montreal for him to be a family with her and her son. What a piece of shit. You know that you're a piece of crap. DB flinches constantly when he screams and leans in. Yeah, she probably gets handsy with her. That's how I was flinch. Remember that in video in my room where he smacks something and I flinch? The reaction channel is because he's fucking smacky. Yeah. 18 days until his big day. Watch his drug use and drinking amp up significantly. That's a sign of abuse. Why didn't they end up getting together? He tells she's in the States, fuck. <coughs> he tells these women what they want to hear. He doesn't actually want he just needs a supply. So whoever is willing to supply him, he's gonna like. Oh, you got it all figured out now. You got it all I figured out. Him? No. No apartment. No money. No sex. Nothing. No thumbnail. When's your last thumbnail? Who gives a shit about a dumb ass thumbnail, dude? Nobody cares. Nobody gives. I make my own thumbnails with in stuff I have around here. Nobody gives a shit about a dumb ass thumbnail. Who gives a shit, dude? You think that you can hold shit over people's head. Nobody that is real life gets their own dough, has their own shit, has their own crib, has their own whip. No real man, a real man, gives a flying shit about somebody making a low budget ass thumbnail. Real motherfuckers are about their dough. Real people get dough. Real people hustle, get their shit by any means legal, and ain't nobody worried about a dumbass thumbnail. Shit. You're taking pictures for with my iPad I gave you, you bum. Don't eat, oh man, I could destroy this guy. Kodak, <gasps> welcome, love. Slappy Pappy. I'm lucky. I'm so lucky. What about the time he throws a knife? Huh? Marble mouth. It's not the accent, it's just, yeah. I'm trying to tell you, you did a great job jumping from that sinking ship. She didn't jump, dude. I'll come she did not jump. She got kicked off the ship. Oh my gosh, y'all. No, you didn't jump the ship, dude. You begged him to come to that hotel. We seen the messages. Jesus. Quit trying to spin the narrative. Good God, y'all. Lucky, but I'm not going to say I'm better for it. Like, I don't know. With quitting the cocaine, I thought that was going to ruin my life. And I was like, no, I'm not letting it. Everyone, see if I can do it, you can do it. Everyone has Shut the ability. Shut up. You are not an Even inspiration. If you to do it. That's your shitty attitude. Everyone has the ability. Everyone has the fucking oh, ability. Oh, the old OG inspiration God, here. For a reason. Find it. And mine was, my, the Find reason it. that I was put in my life was to teach me a fucking lesson and to be stronger. Well, damn, what, you sure ain't learned the lesson yet. If this is a less shit. Yo, she's wearing me out today. Thank you, Lisa. I'm serious. I apologize, y'all, for you guys and the replay. I know I've been cussing like a sailor today, but I am... Marine, welcome, love. I am so sick of just the delusional, the just... I'm like, who the hell pays to hear this bullshit? It's, it's like I'm worn out. Like, for you to sit here and say, dude, shit on here... Dude, this is way over $200. Screw your 200 bucks. Screw it. You're not stunting with 200 bucks, dude. 200 bucks ain't shit. We shit on 200 bucks over here. 200 bucks is nothing, dude. Nothing. Stephanie, welcome and sorry I'm not trying to floss. I'm not trying to front, but you're 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 talking about a chick that because she's homeless, you think she's on drugs when you clearly were on drugs and I don't know if you're still on drugs. 
and you're ta yeah, two, two hundred, dude, a hundred and something, two hundred and something, two hundred and something, another two hundred and something, dude. This is probably eight hundred fucking dollars right here. Like two hundred bucks is nothing. It's dirty money that you have. Dirty ass money. You've played this plot out for the last year, year and a half. Sexual abuse, lying to the cops, kiss 200 bucks, stick it in your ass. Nobody cares about 200 raggedy ass dollars, dude. That, I find that so offensive, y'all. Oh, come on my channel, porch girl, for anybody that's coming in. Uh, she offered $200 for the the girl on the porch to uh, get her clean, take her to a shelter. Get the hell out of here. I don't know who this, this public figure shit has flew. Right, Amber Nicole? 200 bucks, Chantal. You won't even fill up your tank because you're too damn lazy. 200 bucks. Get out of here. Pathetic. Sing your song. Shit. I have to do in my life. 200 no, bucks. I said to Gary, if I, if I did it to you as a kid, you wouldn't be able to sit down. No, he didn't say that. It. Gary, I'm really sorry that you had to hear Shut that. Shut up That's and fun. leave Gary alone, too. That's disgusting. No, something told me, like, honestly, it was probably divine intervention. Because something was telling, nagging at me, like the whole drive home. Remember I went live and was like all happy that I was spent time with matter. And then my mood changed. And then I did a live stream. I know what it is. Ugh. What was that? What did I say on that live stream? That's, that was my final fucking straw. Those realizations I came to. Did you buy that big brown kitchen table? Man, he thought he was a real chef after he got that. Oh no, fuck. That's from his ex. His ex gave him all that fur furniture. I said that on his blood. What a sick fuck. He's a sick fuck. Of course he said that. So are you. Hey, Aunt Janet. He, he slapped me, so this is what happened. Oh, good God almighty. After we got found out about Motel Adam, I raced back there. I was like, oh, fuck, they're gonna, like, you know. He went live. People know where he is. He was trying to pretend he was on a date. I said, you know, we couldn't be honest then because he wasn't supposed to be around me. Um, a dome sub symbol. What? Anyway. This was from my fucking grandma. He, uh... Okay, wait a minute. Here's Motel another Adam. thing. He went back to his place. I don't believe... I've been wanting to say this for a while, and I know it's petty as shit, but if we're gonna be petty today, let's just run it. I don't believe that necklace is from her grandma. If you remember... Right, Lisa? And listen, I want to make this clear. I do not want to sound like I'm ungrateful. That is not what... Um... Listen... I'm not trying to floss. I'm not trying to... I am, I'm grateful for every dollar you guys give me. I want to make that clear. That is not why I'm like... The porch thing really pissed me off. You guys know that I struggle with addiction. And that really just hit me to the core. So I'm not bragging about the things I have. I'm not, you know, about this... Like, I appreciate everything you guys do for me. I do not make shit on the ads on here. So I, I don't want that to come across as, like... that. That's not what I was... That's not the message. That That's not what I... I totally... Hell, if it wasn't for y'all and after pay, I wouldn't have half the shit I have. So let me be honest. But what I'm saying is to put a message out there for somebody that is struggling, if they are. And I didn't want to say that because I don't even know this girl. And, um, okay, so here's the deal what I think about the necklace. Remember she ripped the first one off. Okay. A lot of people were saying that this necklace is all across Amazon. So, remember the first necklace that people were like, oh, this is your gat? No. And thank you, Lisa. Yeah, I wasn't trying to be like, oh, you know, money's nothing. I do struggle. I want to put that out there. I buy all that shit on Afterpay. Kalarn, yes. It's my buddies. Y'all hear me. Um, I wait, get shit on sale, use my low codes. But what I'm saying was, for her to offer that, $200 to that girl is disgusting. Um, 
you, you guys know. I don't have to say it. But anyways, I think that she ordered another one of those necklaces. Um, I, I think she ripped the first one off, regretted it, and I, I, I don't think that's... What are the odds the two... And, and maybe, hell, maybe I'm just being Betty, but what are the odds those necklaces, the heart necklaces, is almost identical? I think that she regretted ripping the... <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> ripping the first one off and bought another one. Yes, falling on a budget, as we say. And I do apologize to you guys and the replay. And, um... Oh, filthy. I think she totally got that stuffed animal out of that pot. Like everybody said, throw a match to it. It's in the pot. The pot's, you know. See, I don't know. Lara says there might be ALR has one from Torrid, possibly. Yeah, she could have got, you know. But you guys know I'm all about a budget. I'm all about getting free shit. I'm all about getting, you know, stuff on sale. Man, thank you, Bobbleheaded. Man, when somebody is going through something and they don't have a place to live and they're struggling with substances, I told y'all at the end of my run, per se, we'll call it, I was doing like, I shouldn't even tell y'all this, but what the hell at this point, I was doing 9 to 11 blueies a day at $50 a WAP. So, do the math on that. And again, I'm not trying to glamorize. I'm just saying, unicorn, welcome. Um, she, 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 that's, you know, why, why throw money, you, you, you throw money out. You, you throw, maybe that girl, you know, lost her job. You know, this is right when the vid was going on. Maybe that girl lost her job. Maybe she lost her apartment due to some kind of, you know, you never know. Thank you, Frosty. Like, y you're assuming because the girl was home, and I can't stand that. A lot of mental, a lot of people that are homeless have mental health. And you, Chantal, should know that after all the shit you watch on YouTube, um, you know, it's, 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 don't assume, you know, times are hard out here for people. Hell, there's time that I have just enough to pay the bills. That's why I put all that shit on afterpay. So, you, you try to lure people in with your money, Chantal. Fact of the matter is, 200 bucks ain't shit, and you're, uh, like, come on, man. Get over oh, yourself. Was around. He was getting all antsy, and it was such stress. Like, I don't even want to relive it. He was yelling at me. I'm back from Syria. Welcome. Ready, set, rabies. Um, so I'm like, let's go to a hotel. I'm like, what do you want to do? Like, I cannot stay. It didn't make sense for him. He wanted to stay in Gatineau at his old place, but he was paranoid about the cops finding us out. Because I was like, let's go to mot a motel in Montreal, then you're closer to Didi's house. He's ignoring Dee Dee. He's probably lying at her the whole time that he needs to be in Gatineau. So Dee Dee's freaking out. Anyway, we go to Motel Monday. Nice, Holly. For a night, fucking 350 or whatever a night. It was like expensive. Yeah, and that's another thing, money. Unicorn. 200 measly ass dollars with all the money you make. All right, y'all. Hold on. I want to see the stupid part if I can find it. Hopefully, we didn't pass it. And let's see what she's looking like now. And then we'll wrap this up. And. So we get to the hotel. I'm looking for Uber Eats. And he's like on his phone, right? I'm doing something. See, so I, I don't like, remember any of like, this, like, yeah, I hope I, I didn't skip it. And I'm like, uh. So I was like, let's just look for something a bit cheaper. And I was like, I don't think he heard me. So I'm like, oh, Donair and Fries. Like, they look really good. From a place called Koufax or something like that. Like, it looked like really good. So then I fucking like... I order it. Not thinking he would care. It's like free food for you. All right, dude. I, I can't. Hopefully Piggy or somebody will clip, clip it. Um, I must have passed it because I didn't even hear the stinking part about the hotel... 50 times that we've heard. Okay, so speaking of 50 times that we've heard, ready, set, bees. Uh, let's check it out. Ready, set, bees. Who would have thought? You're Chantal. I love these title. I thought it was a work when it was like, um...
It looks like a powder to me, like a bit crystally crystals or something. Whoa, wait a minute. What are we missing here? Uh, Hold on. Okay, this is live, and I ran it back. Um. Phew. Vent. We are here. We vent. Let it all out. What? This is our vent fed up bullshit with Chantal Saturday. Okay, let's hear. I just ran it back when I heard the word crystally and liquid. I want to hear is she spilling the beans? Yes. So the last I left him, <clears throat> like I said, I dropped him off. What the he hell? was ready to kick him out, and I couldn't understand. If they were just friends, because I believed him. Oh, good why God Almighty! Why would she have a fucking problem with me? Oh, he's very Carolina. He's obsessed with it. With anal, obsessed. JP says she's probably so smart. Is she thick, Grayson? I don't know. I never heard her say that. Right? Can we put some? You took the time to put on this. Thank you, guys. You took the time to put on this eyeliner, this daggone lipstick. And this wig. And you can't put some damn clothes on. So let's hear... I, I want to hear whatever she's talking about. Crystally liquid. Let's hear... And here you go again. Talking about stinking anal. That I thought you were so traumatized about. Like... You, you just... You, oh my goodness. Art. Yeah, it's the one. I'm like, hello. I don't know if it was a liquid. It was like, um. It looked like a powder to me, like a bit crystally crystals or something. I wonder what they're talking about. I think. I, I don't know. Like, I can't really remember what was in the other one, though. What, what, what? does he. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not commenting on that. Some people are just really into it, I guess. I'm not. So, try and keep it smooth in the chat, and I will too. So, there's only one thing that looks crystally if you catch my drift. Um, I don't know. That's what I'm wondering, you filthy animal. Um, so, okay, she's talking about all his substances. Yeah, there's only one thing that I recall. Yeah, math is all I can think of. Yeah, there's a problem if you are, but you should respect when someone's not into it and don't make them uncomfortable. Well, why talk about it with your ex and why let him do it? Um, I think that might be a little, you know what, I'm not even going to say it. Chantal, you're very I'm close to uh, a wardrobe malfunction. Oh, really, Right, wow. nurse, and welcome. I mean, it's... Thank you, Dan, Amber. Look, and she's even, like, you can, uh. like... She's like propping him up. Elizabeth, welcome up. Military helmet. No. <laughs> oh, this is live. This is live. We're about three minutes behind. Isn't that she will be discontinued soon? So when? No, dude, just, see, this is the hard. shit. Like, your chat, dude, is your own worst enemy. Your chat is your own. Get a Nashi. Get a Nashi. Your chat, dude, is your own worst enemy. Your chat is your own, like, yeah, this is right now, y'all. We're about three, maybe four minutes behind. <laughs> no more Nashies, right? Okay. Or chicken wings. Oh my god. Here we go. More food. What I <laughs> didn't I say today, y'all, that she's already been smoking. It's about to 
eat and eat and eat the, the rest of the day. She's just going to eat. Watch. I think he made it here because he misses you, and this is all a show to rub it in your face. Oh, good but God. You get back with him. <laughs> Did he make the creamy paneer? What oh, kind of paneer did he make? I thought you, you were know what? From... This was so okay. How do you celebrate celebrate your coming together to make your fucking ex jealous? Like what a loser. Suzanka, <sighs> welcome love. Mm. We love you, Chantal. You are strong and we'll get through all this nonsense. Okay, let's see what it was. Thank you, Desert Roll. That's so sweet of you. I'm <laughs> Desert Rose scares me. I'll watch the whole thing. And that was a lie to get you to get and pay for him to have an apartment. She even said she wanted him to take as much from you. He was an abuse. The she can't even read a whole ass sentence. Yeah, Kelly, I think it's the same. I, I can't tell, but I think it's the same raw, I'm pretty sure. Like, how <laughs> What I find so low class is that she used your platform in front of me. It's just gross. Sorry, the little bit. Kaya, what's the person's name? I'm confused, y'all. Whose name? Yeah, Christina, I'm lost. What's the person's name? I'm lost, y'all. Oh, the person that started the uh, Desert Rose is who started this whole control and chat shit weird Federale YouTube police. Yeah, it was the Desert Rose chick. Yeah, she's 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 the head Federale. She's the head Federale. Yeah, she's the head Federale. She's told Peach she's staying on all day. Oh, my gosh, y'all. Well, we'll watch a minute of this nonsense, and uh, it's probably the same old. And then we'll do get off, and we'll do a quick little haul and just chill out for a second. Homophobic, yeah. Hot-ass yeah. Bishnai, welcome. <laughs> Jessica, do you see Dee Dee? She's like five foot thirteen. Her feet are size thirteen. Did you Who see her? Who cares, hand? dude? Listen to me. I cannot stand Dee Dee. Okay, but let's discuss this. Chantal, you can change your weight if you got your shit together. Dee Dee, I do not like Dee Dee, but I'm just saying this in general. Why do you... Dee Dee cannot change the size of her feet. And I'm saying that for anybody, not just... Why do you find things that... You talk about guys' eggplants. You talk about, oh, I don't like this. I don't like that. You can change your weight. Nobody can change... Again, and I'm not writing for Dee Dee. I'm just saying in general. Nobody can change their damn shoe size. You find the dumbest things to pick on people. It's not a roast. It's not. You find the silliest shit. DG, I'm with you. Welcome, everybody. Make sure you're subscribed. Welcome, everybody. Chilling in the background. Right? Like, thank you, sarcastic. Like... She is superficial, and she has absolutely no reason to be. She needs a straight jacket. <laughs> um, else, she's just... She needs a straight jacket. <laughs> well, well, well. Stay with him? Because I thought he was lying to me, Aubrey. Like, bad. And I believed him because I wanted to believe the lies. I loved him. Or thought I did. Now, ew. She looks like Stephen Harper in drag. I know. He told Dee Dee to shut the fuck up when she asked him what BLT stood for. Make me a BLT sandwich, please. 
So there again, your roommate's talking about transitioning. And yeah, this is live. We're about that much behind. So your roommate again is talking about transitioning. And you're talking about she looks like Stephen Harper in drag. Such a supportive little buddy. You're such a supportive. Ooh, enchiladas sound great. Chantal, you're such a supportive best friend you are. Let's speed this up a smidgen to 1.25 and we can get caught up. Yo, I don't think this is going to be the same old. Right? Right? Pronounce, uh, yeah, the... There's something that small sets them off. Spooky, oh welcome, love. She doesn't mind. She signed up for it. They're going to get pedicures. Do you think they will charge them both the higher rate for them? That's funny. <laughs> uh -huh. Stupid. That <laughs> looks like the crisp paper. He's literally going to trial for fucking grape on August 3rd. I'm going to go get a pedicure on Dee Dee's dime. I know, Lola. That's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> he says what the fuck she wants about Chantal, so she's fair game. Oh, God. Okay. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> oh, like, that haircut is fucking genius. I don't care what her name is. Oh, Lana, congrats. Right, Raccoon Man? And did y'all see she went... Now, let's... She went... Let's see if she puts her finger in her mouth. I know it sounds disgusting, but... I don't give a shit, Carolina. Maybe we'll do that there. <laughs> I don't care. Right, Mary? She just... Yeah. She has pause on her condo finances. Yep. Let her Kenny know. I've never seen that. Right, <laughs> true. <laughs> Look, yeah. Right, sarcastic, it just became a whole new negative bunch that are even... Okay, here's the thing, though. At least the trolls made funny jokes and stuff. These people done told her today to hit man. Yeah, if you're just coming in late or just coming in or the replay, this... Oh, I'm going to turn my chat into a positivity. This group of people told her to hire a hit man. All right, y'all, let's watch two more minutes of this. This literally doesn't look like anything that is Chantal. This is what I'm going to predict. I'm going to predict that she's going to sit here for a minute, and she's going to predict, oh, guys, I'm hungry. What are we going to have for dinner, guys? I'm hungry. Someone in our chat said they should hatch a plan to put Natter and Dee Dee in jail. Yeah, so much for your, uh, your, um, positivity box. Or maybe that is a positivity box for you. Wait, it's so oh my God. She's, like, she's totally mumbling. <laughs> Rhonda, I know. I can't even keep her in. Sorry, y'all. That's why I keep moving it. Man, that's so funny. The fucking... I can't. Dude, you're killing me. You're not even saying nothing. I don't know. I've never heard of Lakata. Hi, Helene. Let's see. Not like cleaning your ears on stream. 
Carolina, we are absolutely laughing at the haircut, okay? So cry somewhere else. <laughs> Oh no. Peace and love. You might not like the fact that we're laughing at someone's haircut here. Yeah, dude. Why does <laughs> she have to completely like. She has big KOC. Yes. And they're like the best BLT. Peace and love. Welcome to the airport. Baby, we should have peace. Hi, Bjorn. Hi, BJP. <laughs> uh, right? Like, dude. Yeah. Because she doesn't want to admit to him that it's Did sucks. she just throw that Q-tip? She just flung the Q-tip. Oh, my God, Chantal. Your poor mama when you was a teenager. I can only imagine. Get another Q-tip. Rub it on your face. Rub it on your back. Um, if you let it correct, it was a such in six months that your hair, you totally ask for people to make fun of your haircut. Oh my god. When his hair was really bad that one time, was it because he did it himself? Yes. Probably. Dude. Holy I don't know if it's good for her career, I mean. Is she just throwing this shit on the floor? Looks like she's wearing a fucking helmet. Well, we <laughs> could say that. Yeah, I mean, I know. Right, that. Frosty, I'm yeah. about to tap out. Oh, if she don't... Like, oh she's too. But yeah, I guess I'm being childish then and low. <laughs> Brandy White, welcome. Yeah, <laughs> she she literally like, dude. Do we even need to discuss your hair before the hair fibers? All right, y'all. I think we'll watch another minute, and I think we gotta tap out. We've been on here forever, and she ain't really talking about nothing. To be honest with you. Oh my god, this guy is so crazy. I can't even keep her in frame. It's pathological. You are too, bud. You are too. No, you are. <laughs> Hi, Rochelle. No, no. Trying to think of food. Trying to think of food, she said, y'all. Trying to think of food. She acted holier than now in the chat when she was screwing. Oh, I thought I heard them. Um, I can't even keep her in the damn frame. Hey, Tessa. Pizza's recording. Desert Rose, ignore the haters. KOC support you. Thank you, Desert Rose. All right, Thanks for the super chat. Oh, Desert Rose, send her a super chat. All right, y'all. Let's end this on this note. Yeah, it's, I can't anymore. It's, I'm sure that we're going to be ordering some kind of something. She's talking about food. All right, y'all. Um, I tell you what, I'll take a break and then we'll come back. Let me, I, I need a break from this mess. Take a break, and then we'll come back tonight, do like a little hole, shoot the shit. I need a break, y'all. I apologize. She has worn me out today, and it's starting to get hot in here. So let me cool down. I'll probably rinse off, and we will come back, do a little haul, probably chill out for a little bit, regroup myself, because... A little razzle-dazzle there for a minute. And guys, I apologize for you guys on the replay. I don't want to, like, 
She had me mad about that girl. So, yes, I'm going to chill out, cool down. I'll probably take a shower. I'm starting to sweat. And thank you guys for being here. Um, yeah, this was... I don't even know. So, yeah, I'm going to pop in the shower, I think, honestly, because it is getting, like, once it stopped raining and the sun came out. Um, so, yeah, so I'm going to rinse off, chill for a minute, and then we'll just come back. Yes, definitely. We'll see how things go as far as, yeah, the braid is done. Actually, I'll come back with another thing we got to review. Then I can ditch, yeah, the braid is done, but we got something to review tonight, and I've got to do it tonight. So, I love you guys. Thank you so much. Thumbs up. Uh, Steph, it's all like crap. I mean, it's muggy and it's supposed to rain the rest of the night. So, probably no swimmy today. But it's been a busy week for me, y'all. So, chill. I'll probably see y'all in a little bit. And I love you guys. Have a great day. Great night. And I'll put up a community tab before I go live in a little bit. Love you guys. Thank you so much for being here. Get some rest. Take your cat nap. Eat some lunch, dinner. Get some rest. I'm going to chill out for a little bit. These, oh, it's starting to, you see, I'm starting to sweat. So, Whoopi dogs have been very peaceful. I'm very proud of that. That's amazing. So, keep your eye out on the community tab, and I'll give you guys a heads up. I almost said love you guys night. I'm used to the night time. I love you guys. Hope you have a rest of your great day, or great day, and I'll see you all in a little bit. Bye, guys.